Welcome 
to my corn kids 64 stream welcome thank you very much for the 22 months cocoa balls i'm sorry you didn't get the funny text to speech my bad hello welcome welcome Welcome, Jusagi, Catastro, Ink and Coffee, Pancake, Rally Derby, MJKM, Bunny Walk, Subcat, Mac Geek, Namington 2D, <laughs> Ratty, Adderall, Frank Tinsley, Nafel, Marble and Gold, Sankuncito. Welcome. I hope that doesn't mean that word in Spanish. I don't know. I don't speak Spanish. Felius Goodman just subscribed. Lily hope he has. <laughs> Hi. Thank you very much for the 37 months. I'm very tired today. I'm very tired. I've been studying for exams all night I see your name all fancy cause it's a fancy name hi to Glam hi all his pickles hi you have son welcome hi Derek Alaric hi Village Gleamer hi Comfy Rat hi Chunky Beef Thrust yeah I'm streaming to rest this is my break I've been studying all the weekends, and now it's time. It's time. Also, uh, if you think of a survival crafting game that you think I, I haven't played, but I would like, feel free to recommend it, and I want to stream one. I am going to stream a survival game this week sometime yeah studying has been going well I got Taco Bell last night as a study reward Kenshi Kenshi is goaded you like don't starve that's such a good one don't starve I haven't played that Hey, Linky Coast. What happened to Taco Bell Day at three days? Oh, we're gonna go to Taco Bell. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Stay there. I was gonna go to Taco Bell. You took away for a year. <laughs> you took it away. And that makes me so mad. I'm so mad right now. <laughs> the nacho dream. <laughs> when you when he talks, he makes like a goat sound. This is a dream about the taco place. He wants nachos. <laughs> Listen to the walk sound. What in tarnation? This game is cute. Edme the Edme just subscribed. Okay. Can I drive? No. Of course you can't drive. What's this? <gasps> A fly. Fly. I like eating flies. Don't tell anybody. When I'm in my pond, sometimes I like to just... What the heck is that? Some kind of bug. Huh. <laughs> hmm. 
Thank you very much for the prime sub, Edna the Edna. Five hard shell tacos, please. What the heck? This ain't the ta taco hoop emporium. What's going on here? Hi, Steve. Oh, oh, it's Alexis. Where is this place, Alexis? This is my park. What do you think? Isn't that cool? It looks like if I take one step into this place, I'll get eaten by some inflatable clown demon. Oh <laughs> no, come on. I made this up. I made th up this park so we can trade our corn powers. How many times do I gotta tell you? There's no such thing as corn powers. We're just, we're just developing. We make. We're just developing. <laughs> Are you allowed to say that? <laughs> no, come on, we totally... <laughs> we totally have... <laughs> come on, you know, like you could do a headbutt in the air by jumping and pressing the action button. <laughs> That's because this is a dream. Normal goats can do that whenever they want in a dream and all it can... Oh yeah, this is a dream. Now all this dumb crap makes sense. This game is edgy. Very edgy. Anyway, I'm getting out of here. Where'd the door go? Oh. It's up there now. See it? What? How does that make any sense? I like their facial expressions. This game is very cute. Oh right, I almost forgot already. Uh, anyway, I made sure to play it. Has gifted us up to any of these genius. <laughs> oh yeah, true, true. This is Tamford in 1995. I was watching Henny of the Genius earlier. Very cool. Thank you very much for the tier 3 gift sub assistant, Molly, and I hope you enjoy the stream. Thank you very much for your kindness. I made, sure not to, I made sure to put up lots of sticky notes to tell you how to use everything in the park. So make sure you read all my sticky notes, okay? That's the button to the left of the jump button, by the way. I hope you know where that is. And then you could get up there for sure. Come back. Want to be my friend? What's this? Basic butts, tee hee. <laughs> <laughs> Press action button in the air to headbutt forwards. Press L trigger to headbutt downwards. Mmm. Okay. Ah, oh, that's how you butt. Oh my gosh. That's so cool. Hi, Uber Hobo. Hi, EQRQ. Welcome. Yeah, it is like a cartoon. I agree. Press the zoom button to zoom. Press the R button to center it. Hold the R trigger to get a closer look. Oh, I see. That's cool. It's kind of like a Mario. A Mario-like. You can bounce on some objects. Press L trigger to do a slam butt. The springy guy. Okay, I'm the springy guy. Look at this guy. Oh wow, I got some kind of cube. Some kind of default blender cube. Thank you very much, Linky, because I'm doing well, but I've been studying all weekends. Yeah, I'm studying for some exams. So this stream is actually a break for me. What's that? Some kind of... No! Oh, my health is like a Mountain Dew. Oh yeah, that's cool. Press action button while swimming to dive underwater. Oh wow, cubes. I have to get all the cubes. Goats are supposed to stick their tongue on everything. Yeah, where did you learn that, goat simulator, huh? Huh, did you learn that at the goat simulator? 
The real reason I got this game is because I thought the music was a banger. A boost pad. Head by the boost pad. You can jump again after you use it. Oh wow. I jumped on the boost pad. What do I do now? Oh wow. Treasure. Unscrew the screw with the action button. It's a crank that's inside and you need it to open the door. The action button. What's the action button? The gameplay is very smooth, I would say. Don't run off the ledge and fall on your face. <laughs> you can tiptoe if you want. I'm trying not to read this note. It's hard. It's hard not to read the note. Unscrew the screw with the action button. <laughs> oh, I think the health is the soda. That's what I think. And the cans replenish it for you. The action button. Which one would that be? Mm hmm. Unscrew the screw. But the action button. It's actually a crank that's inside. But, but when I get too close, it highlights the node. So there must be a different button than the one I'm pressing. Ow! What's this? A comfy mattress will cushion your fall. Of course you may be in motive. Thank you very much. That's kind of you. Yeah, you don't have to ask to do fan art. You do not have to ask. Mm -mm. Akirati, <gasps> thank you very much for the raid. Thank you very much. I hope you'll have a great stream, Akirati. And everyone, please follow Akirati. One of my friends. A bomby bird. A bomby bird will hatch from this egg. Headbutt him, and he will be stuck on your horn. Press R and the action button to fire him, and he will explode. Try to explode him gently. I bet we can blow up that and it'll do the Zelda blah 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 blah. I bet you would have to use that to unscrew the thing. This is called Corn Kids 64. It's about kids with corn powers. Some EXP is buried underground. Sixty-four. <laughs> yeah, there are corn powers. They're corn powers. <laughs> Hi, Nyrator. Hi, Crocobos. Hi, Roar Supras. Hi, Bear Galaxy. Welcome. We're recording powers. You wouldn't get it. It's kind of complicated. But I can't, I can't get up there because I have to headbutt the jump pad to get up there. But doesn't this look, doesn't this look like it's... Oh. <laughs> doesn't that look like this would uh, unscrew the thing? But I don't think I can. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's okay. Maybe there's another one. Oh, you always oh, see. Look. Oh, the corn kids. The corn kids. You can swing. Ow. I'm gonna die in the tutorial. I, I don't. I don't think I can get that treasure. I just don't feel like I can. A comfy mattress will... Okay, don't touch it. Okay. Okay. 
Hmm. Okay, I see a cube up there. Hmm. Maybe there's something un under here that I missed. I bet you. Hi, fish. I think a nice little fish to a water level is such a good touch. Maybe you have to do a midair action? Oh, you're probably right. That's smart. That's way smarter than what I had. Headbutt into a crank. And repeatedly spin. Oh, that's... See, here's where they tell you it. It's missing the crank. Okay, and this is where I get the crank. Dream soda. If you re you have to refill your soda, because if you lose all your soda, you die. You have to insert. Roar underscore super rush just subscribed. No Lily, don't die. Cool kids, don't die. You have to insert three dollars and forty nine cents. Oop, too bad. I guess I forgot my pants. Thank you very much for the two months roar super rush. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> this is like the beehive in Banjo-Kazooie. <gasps> Nuppy! Nuppies! <laughs> Maybe it's Nuppy Z, but I want to pretend, I want to believe it's Nuppies. Nuppies! Like a special type of puppy. Thank you very much for the raid. I hope you had an awesome stream and thank you for raiding me and I hope you have a great day. This is an EXP cube. If you're good enough, it will open up a new area. Climb the ladder. Level up. Level up. <laughs> what is this? What did I do? You can actually scamper up the wall. It's an ability that you have. What the heck is that? Some kind of bird. Slam into the screw and press the action button a bunch of times to unscrew. Makes me dizzy. Very important message alarm. If you run off the edge, you're gonna fall down and get hurt. Okay, that's cool. I don't understand what you're trying to tell me. Oh, wow! Look! What? Oh, I see, I see. That's how you do it. So this game is... Okay, okay. I understand. Is that what I'm supposed to do? I should read what it actually said because this is kind of challenging, actually. I'm feeling challenged. You know a place where you can get a hot dog? Uh, yeah. Hot dog store. Duh. You didn't know that. Hi, Tingle. Okay. The key to getting down safely is to push the analog stick lightly to walk off the ledge. Then you can grab the ledge and press L trigger to slide down. Okay, let me try it. Oh. Oh. I'm not much of a battler, I'm afraid. You don't have hot dog trees? No, not where I live. Bed bath and beyond and hot dogs too. This game has a satisfying movement engine. It's very pleasing. Treasure, I wonder what's inside. Unscrew the screw with the action button to open it. I already did that. Stop telling me. This is the crank you can use to open the door. However, there's something else there, you see? Ah, and if I learn the tech that I used over there. See, observe. And now I can do this. Hold down the L button if you need to see what's below. It's a mattress, I know that. Um, 
I already know that video game. I'm already spatially aware. I feel like I can press that button. What do you think? No. Are you from Australia? Do you ever say no? I have some friends who are from Australia and they say no. Oh, I built a robot. <gasps> Let's freaking go. Let's freaking go, I did it. Oh, I hope I can level up. But uh, 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 uh. you think that people from Australia have a difficult time seeing bottles of water? Well, there's where you're wrong, kiddo. Have you ever been to Costco? Before just subscribe. Hi Isaiah, thank you very much for the five months. I really appreciate your support. Corn kids, now there's a game title. You like corn kids? This looks like the back rooms from my TikTok videos. Hello, again. Hi the Melody. Hi Enstrider. Hi Adrenaline Tooth. Hi Mordrate. Irish folk when they have when they say purple burglar alarm. <gasps> I'm cute, thank you very much. You distracted me, I couldn't read this. If you had but a bubble, you can jump off of it. Just hit hit and hold down the jump button when you make contact. Hi, Crystalent. What the heck, P Diddly? You can't talk about wieners in here. Snail this user. You love that video? Do you know the mulch gang? My friend Garrity showed me. What is that? Did you hear that jingle sound? That probably means there's a chameleon moth. I've been thinking about purchasing a Machubili. <laughs> they disguise themselves as objects, and they only come out if you headbutt them. They're worth 5 EXP. He isn't disguised as a lamb. I already checked. That's what I was gonna check. It's that. It's that thing. Are you sure it's not the lamb? Okay, good. It's the Machelian. Got him. Got him. Look, it's a sock monster. It looks like a little elephant. The sock monster. It's a little elephant. Those are the most advanced graphics I've ever seen. The PlayStation can produce mind-boggling effects. I actually believe, I believe that mainstream AAA publishers and developers could make a 2D retro-inspired game. And it would, I believe it would do great with mainstream audiences because, because look at Stardew Valley, look at Look at Mega Man 10 and 11. Look at all of these examples of 2D games. Undertale. Look at all of these games. You don't have to have a game be 3D and photorealistic to be great. Mario. Yeah, look at Mario. Um, I couldn't think of anything to put here, so I drew you an octopus drinking exploding OJ. Ugh. That's gross. Smart Uvel just subscribed. Hi. Hi. I wonder if Noida was a success. I don't know that much. I would guess no. If there's nothing in the air to jump off of, try using the wall instead. Use a headbutt to reach the ledge. 
Come back, come back. Hmm. Noida that it's fairly popular. Oh, really? Oh, really? I didn't know that. Yeah, I know Noida was big for, like... Well, relatively big for a little bit. In, like, early 2020... It was, like, pretty big, I think. It has 58,000 reviews. Holy cow. That is a lot. If they did that, the shareholders would hold a meaning about the lack of D in the graphics. What is the meaning of this? We are the shareholders. We share this table. That's why we are called the shareholders. We all share it. We sit in our big meeting room and we share things. That's why we're called that. Gotta take out a sock. This, ooh, the water sounds. Okay, this means there are two things we have to hit to open this door. That's what that means. Slam to the left, spin to the right. Slam to the right, spin to the left. Oh, I see. They're teaching us mechanics about the world. Hi, good to see you PC for us too. Yeah, I didn't know Noida was that popular, but it is pretty popular. Hey, bird. What should I blow up? Surely I can't blow up this cage. Oh, do I blow this up? I can't reach it. Oh, I... oh, hi there, Dizentine. Oh, yeah, no spin to the right. Good thinking. You're so smart. Like that. Um, he's not a sheep, he's a goat. He's a goat. What's on his shirt? I want to see what's on his shirt. It's another goat. Hi, Bunko. How are you doing today? I wonder how I can open that cage. I want to open that cage. <laughs> Goat game. Yeah, I am. Welcome. This is a level door. You can only break through if your level is as high as the number. Okay, I'm only level one, so that's relatively low of a level. Hmm. Maybe then I should. Yes. Yes. I finished watching Better Call Saul. That's a good show. Good show, Better Call Saul. Ah, uh, doesn't bounce you higher. Can I get much higher? Hmm. <laughs> Hi, Onassis. Hi, Zygos. Uh, I see a cube. I've seen experience points cube. You got so many clips on TikTok? Hell yeah. 
Skylar, do you know what would happen if I suddenly stopped showing up to Riz Academy? A skibbity so sigma. I can't remember. Hold on. I can't remember how it goes. Walt, please. Just end your mewing streak for once and admit you're a mouth breather. Who are you talking to right now? <laughs> Do you even know how much gaps I riz up a year? <laughs> even if I told you, you wouldn't believe it. Do you know what would happen if I suddenly stopped going to Riz Academy? <laughs> a skibbity. So Sigma that it could be ratioed by Queso. By Queso. <laughs> a Sigma so skibbity it could be ratioed by Queso. I am not the Sigma Skylar. I am the Sigma. <laughs> you think that of me? No. I am the I one am who mocks. The king of Riz. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Do you know what would happen if I suddenly stopped going to Riz Academy? <laughs> I want to bounce higher. Oh. That's it, that's it. You can jump off a wall in other directions too. The game is running faster than usual. Is it? Do you know? Oh, it's normally 30 FPS. Oh, I must have done something wrong. A Sigma, so skibbity. Yeah, maybe my PC is on turbo mode. You're not going turbo, are you? <laughs> Hi, Maggie Man. Hi, Oni. Use headbutts to go from one pipe to the next. You had a turbo button when you were a kid, what happened to it? One of these pipes leads to the top. Do you know what would happen if I suddenly stopped going to Res Academy? A skibbity so sigma. It could ratio queso. <laughs> Got him. Pretty soon I'm gonna be level two. This is how I feel in school too. Like if you're ever studying something and you're like, this is boring. You just think of like the progression. It's like levels up, leveling up in a video game. It's literally the same thing. So Sigma. I decided that I really like Hell Divers. I think that game is excellent. If you press against a surface as you jump, you can run up for a little extra height. Did I do it? <laughs> ah. Look at how cool this looks. There's leaves. Look at the leaves. 
So this originally runs at 30 FPS. Maybe I should restart my game and see if I can fix it. Oh, maybe I should go downstairs and unlock that other door. No, I know I have to go back down there anyway because there's a level three door down there. All right, you made it, Steve. What? How did you get up here before me? And since when can you fly? I can't really fly, I'm just floating on this draft from this portal. <laughs> Got twice as good. Okay. Thank you for the follow. Okay, this was the training mode. I completed the training mode. But I can get more EXP here. This is called corn cakes. And I'm a sheep. I'm a little sheep. You know what would happen. If I suddenly stopped showing up to Riz Academy. You don't know how many gats I've raised up a year. If I told you, you wouldn't believe it. Uh oh. I fell. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I lost my Mountain Dew. Here she is. I'm talking about Mountain Dew, baby. Hey, Hajiga. Isn't that a Yu-Gi-Oh card? Or a Pokemon? I'm talking about Mountain Dews, baby. Oh, isn't there a... Oh, this goes to the pasta. Yeah. It's a Pokemon. Okay, good. Skylar. Do you know what would happen if I suddenly stopped going to Riz Academy? Hmm? Oh, well, that is the door I went through. Never mind. I see experience cube right over there. Thank you very much for the follow. This is kind of tricky, I see. Urge. Is that a crafting game? I wanna learn about crafting games. Cause, cause I'm gonna pick a crafting game and stream it this week. Oh, that, oh, that it is. Ooh, let's go. Oh my gosh. I didn't expect that to happen. It does seem a little fast now that you mention it. After the training level, I will switch. Yeah, I just launched like this. I just woke up like this. To make the challenger is super tough. I'm super tough. Can you pretend? Enshrouded. I haven't heard of Enshrouded. It's new. Is it a crafting game? Is it a survival? 
crafting game. And Shrow did. And Shrow did. Oh, let's go. Very positive. You're the flameborn, the last ember of hope in your dying world of hell. Wow. Similar to games you've played, Grounded. I love Grounded. Oh, let's watch, this watch the trailer. Is to be the end. Then I will tell them of the beginning. Oh. Of how your spark was ignited. Of your will to survive. That looks like the goats watching too. Of the power that flowed from within you into this enchanting realm of beauty and decay yeah okay i'll play that i'll play that that's a good one thank you that's a very good recommendation corn kids stuff like this is better with friends I see. Friends. Hmm. Factorio. I like Factorio. Mountain Dew collected. Dream Soda. There's a clip of Dot Level where she says, It's so cute. Oh yeah, that's my friend. Oh, I got my faucet. I'm dead, I'm a dead goat. I died. Hi, ow. Hi. Hello, Jordan. Corn. Oh, I keep my experience, that's good. I kept my experience. I wonder how big the development team on this was because this game is sick. Your goat is washed. My goat isn't washed, our goat is washed. Oh, I panic. I always panic. That's my problem. Lily Hopkins, your problem is you always panic. Lily Hopkins. Use the wall grab. <laughs> oh look, we're just above where we were when we started. Look, it's a mouth. It's a creature. The entire level was a creature. Uh-oh. Is this game coming to Pretendo? I didn't know Pretendo was really a thing. I just thought it was funny. I just thought it was funny and a little bit creative. <laughs> What's this? 
You got my goat bones. Oh, I see experience. You see that? There's experience orbs out there. See if you can jump past this white pillar. Then headbutt the wall to the right and jump up, okay? Jump past it, okay, and then... No, that doesn't work, you're lying. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Lily Hopkins. Hello, Kokobo. You can head butt up words also. I wanna buy a McKeelian. Oh, hell yeah. Chameleons are such cool little animals. Jump off a wall. Don't tell me what to do. You've said hi to me. So I just like saying your name. Is that okay? <laughs> Um, Lily Hopkin, you said hi to me six times, and you keep saying chameleon wrong. You're losing at the high game. You lose. Good day, sir. Yeah, tough crowd. Sheesh. You didn't know Kokobo is meant to me <laughs> Oh, what's that? That's you! Look! That's you! That's what you look like! This is chat! <laughs> <laughs> That's you, Tomar. This is a crazy tutorial level. What kind of psychopath would make this? This isn't a tutorial. This is just a plain old level. This is a plain old level. For psychopaths. Yeah, I said it. Hi! Hi, Lyrical Curry. Sorry if this is the 18th time I've said hello to you. I'm sorry. Sorry, I'm just thinking about my killings. You wonder what made this so speedy? I don't know even. Have you played Dragon Quest Builders 1 or 2? I streamed Dragon Quest Builders 1 while drinking a shamrock shake. A shamrock shake. I remember it's like it was yesterday, my green drink. For a limited time from McDonald's. My beloved shamrock shake. Those shakes taste like toothpaste. And yet I long for them. This is the EXP crystal. It's worth 10 EXP, but you have to break it. That's only two cubes. That's... No, it's... That's 10 cubes, sorry. You might not be able to get through here yet. You can come back later. You can come back later. Don't forget. Don't forget. Oh, yeah, they are good. I like them. Sorry. Hmm. Hmm. I see a cube. Hmm. I see a cube. Hmm. -hmm. I see a cube. I see a cube. I see a cube. I 
Hmm. I want to get the cube. Oh, you're smiling, huh? Oh, you're smiling. You're a smiler. Huh? Smiler? Do you know what would happen if I stopped going to the Rose Academy? Smiler? <laughs> <laughs> Let me analyze this. How can I get over there? I don't understand. You're annoyed it should be an experience crystal. Oh, um, all of these sticky notes have had a bunch of typos in them. I may have missed that little detail. It's okay. I've been, I haven't been reading them out and I've been like kind of speeding through them. So it's an easy mistake to make. Tat whiz is not a word. Stop. Stop whizzing. Oh, all, all of them have um, spelling mistakes. It's supposed to be the girl. She said she wrote them. Okay, how can I get up there? I wonder if I have to go through here. No, this is, I think this is a dead end. Ah, oh. good try, good try. Can I can I leave the? How do I leave this place? Have been here. What's that? Oh, this is where it's one DVS BSDR DXX just Hi! Welcome. Thank you very much, one DVS bastard, for the two years of support. Thank you very much for the two years. Cool bench. Steve! Why did you put the portal next to the dumpster? Um, I wanted to be sure the door over there at least out of the dream realm. A realm with infinity nachos. Are you sure this game is running fast? Don't forget your training, little corn cadet. Talk to me if you need any help figuring out what to do. Talk to me twice, even. I don't know what to do. Yeah, the dirt texture looks really good. Oh, it's twice as fast, exactly. Hmm. Corn kids 64 running too fast. No, I don't want to speed run. Hmm. Ah, I've analyzed it correctly.
Thank you very much. Thank you for helping me. Thank you very much. Thank you for helping me to see how the game is supposed to look. <laughs> Okay, we're back. What the? Come back. <laughs> Thank you. Parking lot. How's this look? How can I go through the door? I like the sounds too. I would put a power up right here. Is this slime? Is this some kind of slime? I like the old speed too. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Checking for secrets. Your Hubert Scott killed you by a dragon. That's okay. That happens to me all the time. Can I climb this? I got used to the old speed. This is kind of slow. I feel like I'm in slow motion. This feels... Mm. This feels kind of slow. It feels a lot less smooth to look at, yeah, yeah. You can play at your own pace, yeah. We have to open that freaky door, but how? You zoom. You can use zoom. Perchance. Ah. I wonder if this is a secret. The mosquito sound like you slap your ear. Whoa, well, no, it's hollow. <laughs> Finger. Owls hollow. The owls took over Wallow's hollow. Hey, over here. Need to ride to the top of the trees. Yeah. Hi, Master Kazam. Welcome. Corn chips. Corn chips and fallout. music is good. That's actually the reason why I got this game. Now you're trapped up here, sucker! Look at him! That must be the owl. 
You enjoyed Fallout 1? All of the Fallout games are on sale right now. You could buy Fallout 1 again to prove you're a real fan. Ow. You could buy Fallout 76. Have you watched the Fallout TV show? I have. Yeah, they made 67 Fallouts. You could buy 76 Fallout ones. An intruder, who? There's an owl that lives outside my house and it hoots all the time. Sacred tree. Emo hog. Emo hog? What mean you? It's a goat. Hi all. New friends, all are welcome here in all those hollow. Stay a while. Bring some friends. We can always use some new blood to help wash out the old piggy type influence. Aww. <laughs> Look at how his head stretches out. Also, keep away from high places like that pointy building over here. That has been rated unsafe for the owl community. I understand. <laughs> hmm, should I go down here? I should. A skull. A polygonal skull. Thank you for the follow. What is this? Some kind of... <gasps> Papa! 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 She's stuck. Oh, it's a time thing. This is cool. This reminds me of Grinch for the Dreamcast. This is just like the Grinch for Dreamcast. A classic game. Absolute banger. Unadulterated banger. Oh, la is mildly unpleasant. <laughs> You're grinched. Do you remember of the PlayStation demo for that? It seemed actually good. Uh, it depends on who you are. Hi. Hi, Sarah Fram. Hi, Sarah Fram. Thank you very much for the eight months of support. Eight months? Hold up. I'm counting on my fingers. That's a lot of support. Thank you very much for your help. And consideration. I'm playing corn kits. Owls follow religion. Twelve-year-old, you would have liked it. The thing about the Grinch is, it can be a little frustrating. It is like, a, it's like, I would say, I would say it's one-third collect-a-thon and two-thirds puzzles. You will get lost. You will be confused what to do. I feel like it draws a lot from like adventure games. It looks like Banjo-Kazooie or Super Mario Brothers, 
but it plays a lot more like a point and click adventure game. That's just my opinion. Wait, did you say no? What? What did I see? Not see. That's a nice camera angle. Eyeballs. No. You thought owls were secular humanists. I get it. That's funny. Who? Because they go. If you aren't the you that that 12 year old you would be. If you aren't the you that 12 year old you would be. Are you proud of that? Hmm. An interesting question. But your values and interests change as you become not a six year old anymore. It's true. Who's this pig? I gotta get through there. Ah, <laughs> oh, another timer. I need to locate where these are. You still just want to play it so you don't know about that? Well, that's okay, too. It's okay if your interests don't change, but they might. You don't remember Corn Kid 64 for the N64. It's not for the N64. That's where they get you. That's how they get you. It's not even for the N64. They lied. <laughs> At least it wasn't speed cubs or clockwise. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was a trick. Can I spin the other way? Okay, Tingle. Who's this? Who's this pig? He's in the mud! Skeleton stick bug just subscribe. He's in the mud. Thank you very much, Skeleton Stick Bug, for the three months. Oh ho! Sneaking into the ladies mug bath. My mud bath. <laughs> There's only one mud bath. There used to be two, but the big one got turned into an owl pellet pit. <laughs> You guys, owl pellets are not poop. They're not. They're undigestible material. They're they're similar to hairballs, but they contain fur and bones. Some people erroneously think that owl pellets are poop, but they're not. Yeah, they vomit them up. Yeah, that's true. Isn't that what poop is? No. No. Something tells me that guy has something to do with the door we saw. You mean the fact he looks exactly like it? Yeah, some people, some people actually purchase owl pellets and they op they crack them open like blind boxes. You know how you can go like, oh look, Oh, who did I get? Oh, I got SpongeBob surfing. Oh, I got Giga Chad Squidward. Some people buy them and they're like, oh, I got a gerbil skull. Oh, I got some tiny bird feathers. I 
It's owl, owl gacha. Gacha. Squidward was eaten by an owl. Yeah, it's true. What would you be most excited to pull from the owl gacha? Hey, ZV, Z, ZVJ. I would be most excited to get uh, SpongeBob on the surfboards. Trinket chop. Thank you very much for the raid, Bravongo. And thank you very much too to Assistant Molly. I don't think you're enough. You're a very, a very hard worker and very cool. Welcome, raiders. Hi, Genshi. I'm not sure if I said hi to Genshi. Who's that? Ravongo just subscribed. Hi, hi. Hi. Have a good stream. Revet, revet. Okay, you too. Thank you very much. Some kind of fish. Party dog. I've heard that animal before. I've heard that animal before. But I need your help identifying it. It's a pig. It's a pig. <laughs> it's cute. They just made a bunch of like 3D models and particle effects and put them in here. And those are the trinkets. Hi. <laughs> He's a saint. Hi, Lily Dusk. Welcome. His snout is so wiggly. You got wiggly snout. Show me your wiggly snout, Skylar. Do you think, do you think you could give a pig a cookie? Do you think a pig would eat a cookie? Must sell at tallest sum. <laughs> You've seen it happen. A pig eating a cookie. Oxygen. I have no oxygen because I'm breathing in the smoke. Attention to detail. What can I purchase? Skylar, do you know what would happen if I suddenly sold all of the wiggly pig noses? What's this? Looks like a Dr. Mario pill bottle. Dr. Mario had a gotcha game. I think it was actually a mobile game, not a gotcha game, but I enjoyed it. Chocolate is poison to them. What if in the far future we discover that chocolate is poisonous to us too? And future scientists are like, why didn't we notice it before? And the other scientist in the lab is like eating it. And he's like, cause it's so good. Hmm. Analyzing. What is this? What's that spinny thing? You're eating a Toblerone? Yeah, this character has really good animations, I agree. It will give you diabetes.
I wonder about a lot of things. Uh, well, I wonder a lot about things we'll realize are incorrect in today's basic sciences. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe it's poisonous, but we're big. Yeah, it's because we're so big. Um, yeah, I wonder too. I see an EXP orb. Oh, that's who's clicking. What the? Ah, it flings you. Germ aren't real. I don't know about that. I don't know about that. Earth flat, germ not real. Mm. Social media good for you. Oh, I need to headbutt it. I need to headbutt it. Can you see them? See what? No. I can't see them. It's hard. Okay, I have to look at what's on the opposing wall. Okay, I've analyzed. You can, you can, anybody can look at germs. You just use a microscope. You use a lens. You leverage our understanding of optics. It doesn't fling you high enough. Can we get much higher? Irk me, yeast is not bacteria, it's a fungus. Like Saccharomyces cerevisiae. I think that's on the other side. Is that it? Whoa, 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 whoa. I think that's it. Level three dwarfs. Fungus creeps you out. Why? It's okay to be creeped out by it though. I don't mean why in a way like you shouldn't be. I'm just curious why you are. It doesn't look like a little open. Hmm, okay. Is this something affected by a switch? It looks like it is. So which switch affects the totem pole? Hi! What the heck? <laughs> oh, um... Good luck, good luck as a nursing assistant. That's a really cool job. And I hope it goes really well. This is the owl. Okay. He kills you. Okay, the owl kills you. 
I just said. Pollution? I don't know. Have you seen all the research that's coming out about microbes that can, um, about microbes that can break down synthetic materials that would last a long time in the wild? And have you seen the research of the new type of plastic that degrades? It degrades in, in the wild after only seven months. Have you seen that? I wonder if using plastics was a mistake. I don't know. I don't have the answer for that. Remember what Mario said, trust the fungus. What's he doing? I love how he looks. He's so cute. He's so cute. I saw a video this week of an owl in a pond and it was swimming like a duck. An owl. How cool is that? It was like a trail cam video. It was crazy looking. I've never seen an owl swim before. Looks like it, it looked like it was just splashing around a bit. Yeah, it's catalysis. It's catalysis. How can I hurt him? He's too strong. It's such a funny sound effect. <laughs> goat's blast. Use your goat blast. I should, I should. But yeah, I think material sciences is really cool in general. Hmm, analyzing. Pig. I want to free the pig. How can I free the pig? You took a materials engineering course in college, really hard stuff, but really interesting. I hope you enjoyed it. Hey, pig. Those lover. Pick back five ball caps. <laughs> Do you like my pig? I just analyzed something. Calculating the angle between atoms and salts. <laughs> You're missing out. You wonder if this could run on actual hardware? I think I read that it does, but it might have been a dream. Stomp him! Stomp the pig! When Mario goes out, stomp and turrets. Well, you have to wonder what he's thinking.
all the best things happen in dreams sometimes. I have dreams about hanging out with my friends. If I ever mistreat a friend in a dream that I have, I always say I'm sorry when I wake up. Analyzing. Ow. You had a dream you had friends, you do love friends. Oh, and a Ted. Okay, this is where we can bomb. <laughs> what if in the future you had a brain computer and you downloaded a retro gaming emulator to your brain like an N64 so you could just think about games and play them you could play them perfectly but then Nintendo heard about it and they they came over and repossessed your brain. They took your brain away. <laughs> it sounds like the plot of a movie, yeah. Oh, there was a switch that activated this. Oh, and I see that you can definitely blow that up. If you have a bird. I'd be okay just playing this level forever. This is a great level. Oh, I need to have another part to open that thing. You know one thing I really like about Nintendo Power Magazine? I love how in the guide sections, they have those like giant maps, those like zoomed out like giga composite, like they draw the huge map of the entire area and it looks like a little toy or something. Those are so cute. Yeah. Multimedia. Sorry if I see a bunch. Video game maps are very cool, I agree. What is this? Oh, this is a digging spot. We don't have the ability yet, I remember. It doesn't open. Hi. Do you know the high game? Gia 67 cheer. Hi. Hi, Lily. Haven't seen you in a bit. Hi, Pangea. I hope you're having a good day. Thank you very much for the 300 bits. Is the game? What kind of game? What game? What game? <laughs> I forgot what I was talking about. Okay, it's next to the mattress. What game? The high game. Oh yeah, I remember the high game. I remember the high game. <laughs> the high game is where... Well, I used to play it with my brother a lot. The high game is basically... You say hi to each other. You go hi. And then he goes hi. And then you go hi. Uh, it's fun. And if you start laughing, you lose. You can say it different ways. Really, the sky's the limit. Ah, I just analyzed this. I get it, I get it now. 
Blue's the one I get happy. Hmm. <laughs> Cataclysm Dark Days Ahead, that's what um Project Zomboid, one of my all time favorite games, is based on. I haven't played it. That's a chameleon. I see it. I'll come back for it. I'm on the clock. Fifteen seconds? Are you bonkers? I can't do that in fifteen seconds. Oh, actually, I probably can, huh? I'm panicking. Sorry, I'm panicking. I'll just, get, I'll reset it. I'll get the chameleon and I'll reset it. That's him. That's the chameleon. Oh, what's this? Some kind of springy pad. Got him. I can't believe level one takes this many cubes. How many levels are in this game? Sheesh. But yeah, I should really give uh, Cataclysm Dark Days a had a chance. Give it a fair shot. It looks really goaded. Has anyone recommended above snakes? No, is that a game? Oh, can I go this way to save time? What the heck is that? That's a switch. What is this? Oh, I keep getting sidetracked. What is this? Okay, I'm not gonna make it in time. I'm not gonna make it in time, but this is how I'm going to route it. I'm just routing right now. Okay, and then you turn like this, then you do a backwards jump, then you die. Practice again. It took you a while to get to the max. Imagine how hard it is to get to level 75 in this game. That's a Final Fantasy XI reference. She's never beating the retro gamer allegations with this one. I like retro games. All I said, Kurok, all I said was that I play fewer modern games because my computer um, is like, I can't run any more games. Please, please, Lily Hopkins. Lily Hopkins, please. Hola, Christian plays games. It's actually Christian gameplay. I'm gonna beat the allegations, I'll show you. I'm gonna beat them. Please, Larry. Please, Larry. Lillian. Yeah, sometimes he does that. Sometimes he says Lillian. Okay, climb the top of it. That's the, that's the threat. Climb the top of it. Allegations? Now I'm interested in what? Spelling school? <laughs> Learning how to spell correctly school? <laughs> <laughs> Frost at Finnell just subscribed. Hi! Miss Lillian Hopkins. Hi, Sunrock Queen. You're too lazy for that fair. You know it's totally fair. Oh, you watched my GTA stream? Hell oh, yeah. Ah, uh, I panicked. I wouldn't have made it in time anyway, would I? Actually, I think I just barely would have. Some people are really talented composers. Uh, but yeah, there have been allegations that I only play retro games. Yeah. 
I've recently been to some allegations. I'm completely unfounded, I assure you. Because I really, really like old school games. And I do. Just calm down and analyze. Oh no. Okay, I'm not gonna make the timer, but I'm gonna try again. I have to make the jump three times. And then, after I make the jump three times, I will press the button. Oh my gosh, <laughs> this is a cartoon sound effect as well. Okay, so you jump, and then as soon as you start to fall, hmm. As soon as you start to fall, wait, there's, wait, there's pillars? Wait, shuck it. Wait a second. <laughs> Wait a second. <laughs> okay. Stop talking, dog. Dogs can't talk. Would you say that this is the game greatest of all time? I say it's one of them. Maybe. You have the most fun- Hi Radio Gen. You have the most fun with old games or newer games that can hit the fun sweet spot. You gotta hit the sweet spot. Hi hey, King Vortigast. With the corn. I have corn powers. I'm a kid with corn powers. Just remain calm. It's all about being calm. Calm is what you must be. Calm yourself, calm, calm. Just be calm, you have eight seconds. It's an eternity in corn years. Oh, now I can open the church because it's midnight. Now it's midnight, I can open the church. Boom, boom. Take me to church. <laughs> what kind of church opens at midnight? Midnight mass, hello. Hello. Church of the dog god. That's who the dog was. And the Lord said unto him, May a moody baby do my yam. That's a palindrome. Wow. Also a palindrome. Are we not drawn onward? We few drawn onward to new era? We panic in a pew. <laughs> What the? <laughs> Eve damn Jason, mad Eve. Hi. My son, church attendance has declined drastically in recent months. Nobody knows why. Really? Nobody knows why. Other than God, of course. <laughs> That's so cute. Oh, it's the dog. Hey, dog. Flee to me, remote elf. <laughs> no, son. A butt tuba? No, son. <laughs> Taco cat. Once lovers revolt now, Taco cat. Wow. <laughs> I love that they have wow. That's so funny. <laughs> oh boy, church. Ugh, well, at least it is at school. 
You're going to need to get to that exit up there. It's a lot of owls to bounce off, but you can handle it, right? It's just like with the bubbles, except sometimes a struggle and may need a bop to get in line. God, a red nugget, a fat egg under a dog. <laughs> If you cut an apple in half, it looks just like a barn owl. Live on time, emit no evil. I want to headbutt some cans in real life. Name tots? No, medieval slave. I demonstrate man. That's too far, yeah, yeah. What about this guy, though? Yeah, probably. Well, the name of this town is also a palindrome. So, even if you don't get it at first, they provide ample opportunity to let it soak into your gourd. Ah, I should, oh, no, oh, thank you. That was nice. I hope he says wow soon. Ah, Satan sees Natasha. Three hours. Oh yeah, I watched that. Pan and Cook. I didn't know who that was until I watched that video. That was my first video I've seen of them. I like his accent, it's very cute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They are relaxing. I like how thorough they are. Pancake. Oh, it's Dutch, maybe. Is it pronounced Casio? It's pronounced Casio. Skylar, do you know what would happen if I suddenly stopped going to Rose Academy? A skibbity so sigma that it could ratio Casio. I have to analyze this more carefully. Mm -hmm. Uh oh. Did you memorize the video? No, just one part. I like one part of it. I like the part about Rose Academy and KCO. That's my favorite. It's your turn. No, it's my turn forever. I have a green controller. Ah. Got fall warp. Excuse me? What the heck is a fall warp? Hold O and R triggers while falling to warp back to last portal. You'll still get hurt a bit from the fall. You have a red controller. Cute. Ugh. You can bounce off the third owl with a f I don't know. I'm not KCO, I don't know what that is. Not Casio. I love that. That's so good. Oh, yeah. 
God, a red nugget, a fat egg under a dog. That cannot possibly be a palindrome. Can I get a fact checker? The timing for the jump is so precise. I love that this guy is here. Oh, I should drink water. Whenever I stream and I don't drink water. Whenever I stream and I don't drink water. The next day I feel like a little horse. That's the expression, right? And then everyone at school will, will ask me if I'm a VTuber. So that's, that's it out. Can't do that. What if when you were at school, you had on, on your watch, you had like a little alarm and it went doo -doo 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 -doo, and it told you when it was time to stream and you like made an excuse to everybody. Like you had to stop hanging out with your friends and you're like, sorry, um, I gotta go. I'll see you later. And then you go stream. And then after a while, they start to suspect, like, hmm, why does she always disappear like that? And right before Lily Hopkins streams? That's so weird. Huh? <laughs> yeah. Why do you need to make excuses to your friends? Because it's a secret. It's to protect them. It's to protect them. You have to protect them because the villains could get them. Yeah, Hannah Montana. <laughs> but for VTubers. <laughs> That's what I always thought it was like. When I first started VTubing. And I was right. I want to get that cube, but I know I shouldn't. Deep down, I know I shouldn't. <gasps> oh! Oh, this is the portal, right? the respawn? How, how long does it take for the soda to respawn? The warp thing is really nice for those tall areas. I told my cousin. Hi. Hi. You have to drink water while you sleep. Oh. I'm not, um, actually, I'm not sure about that. Mm. Oh, it's so, oh, look at that. Oh, it took a little bit of damage. Just like in the prophecy. It's getting warm enough to camp soon. I'm gonna go camping soon. Thank you for watching my stream. This respawns when you, when you use the portal. It reloads the area. So you can take a little bit of damage from the fall and then get soda. I'm drinking a soda. <laughs> I'm drinking a soda. I'm done. It was so nice out today. Yeah, I'm a beekeeper and my bees love good weather. Obamna. Obamna. Soda. Do you sell honey? No. No, I don't. Hey, um, Zhuang. Hello. My day was good. I I've been studying all weekend. Oh, I get it. I, I understand what that liquid is now. I understand. Finally, I get it. That's poo-poo. 
Pangea67 just subscribed. Thank you very much for the 19 months, Pangea. But yeah, I've been studying a lot. I love, I love it when people go on crazy tangents in YouTube videos and then go, but yeah. <laughs> so I've been saying it lately. <laughs> It's so funny. Oh yeah, attendance is down because of the birds. Do you have carnivorous bees that make hell honey? No. No, I don't. I like eating honey though. Sometimes I go outside with a spoon to the hives and I just grab some, just eat some. Say hi to the bees. Sometimes I pet them a little bit. They like me, they all get, they all get it. We're cool, we're cool. Do you ever get a honeycomb for your ice cream? I've never done that, but I would like to. I would like to try. I think I'm pushing this bird in the wrong direction. What's she studying? That's a great question. But it's almost over. You like to pet bees a lot when you were a kid and you'd get them to crawl on your finger. Yeah, I do that too. I do that too. I, I like to hang out with the bees. I like to meditate a lot, and sometimes I go out and meditate in the bee yard. And just hang out with the buzzies. That's what my mom calls them, buzzies. The video would be something simple, and they start talking about quantum science, and then get back to the original point exactly. Hey, folks, speaking facts. The plain VTuber of hell. Did you just Shrek me? Uh-oh. Yeah, this is corn kid. Uh, maybe I don't care about this cube after all. It's kind of tricky to get to. You wish you were a bee. Well, that was hollow. I love this song. Hi, hey, Kuro. I bet Kurok just looked up like, huh? I didn't say anything. <laughs> yeah, Grand Blue Fantasy versus. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Got you. Can I, uh, yeah, okay. So it's like a pipe or a tightrope, whatever. <laughs> you wanna try Narmea? You should. Narmaya. Oh, this is like the other one I found. Oh. We do a little like zooming. I don't wanna jump down. Yet? Maybe I should. It bounces. <laughs> Rip. T Tubbard. Hold on. What does it say? T Tubbard drab butt. Hmm. Ah, we can get back up easily then. What's this? A flower. Why is it bouncing? I think it's a little bit of body shaming, a little bit of a fat joke, a little bit, a little bit of a, a little bit of classic humor. It's a staple. It's a staple of the era. Hey, 
his butt was pretty jab. A new chapter of your life has started. You did something really crazy. Wanna know what I did? How crazy? <laughs> How crazy were you talking? No swimming! Rip. Remarkable Elba Kramer. Stan's characters are super fun. I like Stan's characters. I don't like Abba very much. That's the key character, right? Because Abba has a big key. I knew that there would be an animal in here. Whenever they have a sign that says, do not swim, there's always an animal. But guess what? There's always a treasure too. Every animal hides a treasure. That's what I always say. Where am I? I'm lost. Let's get some oxygen and come back. Yeah, I don't like Abba because of the because of the big key. Palindrome. The short just as you moved. Oh, you moved. Wow, I am also a palindrome. <laughs> That's cute. Oh, I get it. He's trying to fit in. RIP victims of the Taco Cat Massacre. <laughs> Taco cat. <laughs> oh, we need a bomb bird. Red Ipsum, aka Ma Spider. Oh, aww. What the heck is this? What happened? I'm grieving my catastrophic loss. I like spiders, I like them. She would, oh no. <laughs> she would do that. They built that huge grave for her after she donated all our promised inheritance to the owls. That's a mean mom. She had herself buried with my favorite cheese grater as my last punishment. Wah. We have to rob the grave. We have to rob her grave. It's the right thing to do. Got him. Oh, the bar's almost full. Do you see that? Very cool. I need an exploding bird. There's an exploding bird. No, that's a bug. That's a bug. Hi, Ultima Jaga. Oh, level two door, level two door. Oliver Revilo. <laughs> oh, the data is the palindrome. The numbers must mean something else. Rip Dr. Awkward. <laughs> I like that one, Dr. Awkward. Rip. Sneaky Teagans. <laughs> Good night, Marjorie. One, two, three. 
Let's go. <laughs> Skibbity. Ibid. 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 <laughs> no, this one is lit up. This is a quick way to exit the graveyard, I think. Puzzle solver. True. <laughs> What's this? Pizza Queen. I'm level two, baby. I'm level two. I'm hand solo. I'm hand solo. I'm level two. Let me in. I want a game that's more survival than crafting. This is a scary thing. Awkward. This painting is so awkward. There's flowers up in the ceiling. And a bird, bomb bird, bomb bird. Bomb bird. I found a bomb bird. I'm stuck. Subnautica, there's an idea. He wants a game that has equal parts of mining and crafting. I love games that have crafting and mining, mining and crafting. How can I get rid of this painting? What abilities do I have? Hitting it with a bomb, maybe? That's my first thought. Yeah, someone did say don't starve and I definitely want to play that because I've never played it. Hmm. I haven't played Seven Days to Die, but I would like to. I added that to my list too. Thank you very much, Azure Shot. I, I feel like I can't do this yet. That's a chair. Yeah, just a feeling. Multiplayer experiences, huh? But those, but the problem with multiplayer experiences is that they, they require multiple people. I hope nobody in this graveyard died of appendicitis. You mean appendicitis? I sure wouldn't want my appendix to morph into a panda. That sounds like the worst way to die. Hmm, this boulder. I 
Ah, I bet you I'm supposed to like put this in a hole or something, probably. Yeah, it does look like a D20. Let me analyze this really quickly. Oh, I could use it to hold down that switch. Game. Yeah, it's scary how good it is. Got him. Oh yeah, what does this do? That makes the thing come out in the ledge. That makes the thing in the ledge come out. Decap attack. I played the demo of that. Uh, this game is a new release. It came out in like October, I want to say. September. Something like that. Limited run physical release. Oh, I have one of those. I have one of those. Not of this game. Cool, this is cool. I love this game. This reminds me a lot of Ukulele. One of my favorite games of all time. Yuka! Ukulele! Whoa, look how high up we are! Um, but if you slide down, it doesn't look like there's anywhere else to go. Maybe those owl friends can help if you can reach them. Watch out for duties, though. Yeah, retro styles. I I feel like um I feel like there should be more like mainstream games like this. Cuz I think they would do really well. Yeah, you can't say duties. Mega Man Legends inspired, that's such a good idea. I want to buy the, uh, the re-release of Mega Man Battle Network. Did you see that? It's all six games. Well, technically I think it's like 12 games, but that's because there's multiple versions. You never got into Battle Network, it's one of my favorite franchises. Well, actually, yeah, exactly. Oh, it's a scam. That's what my friend told me, but I didn't understand it because like they sent me the game and everything. Is it just that it's like overpriced or something? Oh, where's my owl? This isn't good. I'm missing my owl. Where did he go? Oh, they're known to fall behind on fulfillment. Some people get it and other people won't for months. Oh, that does suck, actually. Don't your lips get dry when you pop? Kind of. Um, I just kind of have like a, like a, like kind of a wet mouth. I, I was trying to think of a way to not say that in a disgusting way, but that's really just the truth of it.
Oh yeah, I do. I do have water. You didn't get your shutter radical edition for almost a year and a half. If it takes almost two years, then I can get why people would be like, this company sucks. And I'm sorry you had that experience. Silent underscore hero ninety one cheer. X one thousand. Hi. Good evening, Lily. Just hopped in after D and D night to say hey. Hope you're doing well. Gonna work and maybe pass out Lily a nap. Okay. I hope you have a great rest, and thank you very much for the thousand bits. And I hope you enjoyed D and D. I hope your characters and your party and all your adventures. And I hope all that was awesome. I hope it lived up to your wildest dreams. There is an owl here, but it's gone now. Silent Hill reference. This game is called Corn Kids. It's because I have corn powers. It's complicated. <gasps> no! No! That is a really nice quality of life feature. I must say. You're doing Star Wars D&D, let's go. Lately I've been showing a friend's Mandalorian. The Mandalorian. I like that show. And I also like the anime series. Star Wars Visions of Hell. The Mandalorian. No, not the Mandalorian anime. Star Wars anime. Oh, yeah. But yeah, there. Oh, it despawned. Did I get it? I hope I got the item. I, I don't think I did. I feel like the one I have, I got from. I feel like the one I have, I got from the graveyard in that tower. That is disconcerting. Hmm. Okay, whatever. You made a Lily Hopkins costume in Stardew Valley. Let's go. Thank you very much. Hope you're enjoying Stardew Valley. Got him. You had a frog. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. That's okay. I, I really enjoy this game. This is a great example of a game I would 100%. Uh, you know the game Ukulele? That was made by the same creators of Banjo-Kazooie, but like... 20 years later or something. I 100%ed that game four times. Ukulele. <laughs> Luigi cosplay. <laughs> people always used to say that I looked like Undertale, and now people always say I look like Luigi. That's funny. How the turntables. You 100% of this, but it was super tricky. 
Fair enough. I'm okay with tricky. I don't mind getting tricked a bit. Uh, Luigi. Hi, Saber Wolf. Hi. Saber Wolf, do you play Hell Divers? You seem like you would enjoy Hell Divers. I like that game. You do? Hell yeah. I just got into it recently and I really enjoy it. I hear a dog. I'm trying to analyze how I could do this. Hello, Gato Demina. I see something over there in the nest. Hell Divers is quite fun. You're playing in Hell Diver difficulty. What kind of weapons do you like to use? I like to use the anti material rifle. I like to be focused on taking down light enemies. And then letting my friends take down the heavy enemies. So I basically deal with like all the crowds and stuff. You are quite chuffed perchance. The fact that this takes you back to the, the, the beginning of the jumping puzzle and it resets the world state. It's such a nice quality of life choice. Did you fight the bugs or the robots? My favorite to fight are the robots. But I have friends who prefer the bugs, so I fight both. But when I choose, I basically always fight the robots. How can I get over there? That doesn't make sense to me. <gasps> this thing is a chameleon! Are you kidding? This thing? Maybe my eyes deceive me. You had the right idea. Oh, really? Ah. Oh. I don't think I can get over there. Oh, look, now he goes. Now he goes. Care to explain? I'm so mad. This song is going on the study playlist. You know it is. This is like a certified relentless banger. This is an unbridled banger. And now he goes over there, see? Oh, I tried to, uh, no, it's, uh, I just tried to, uh, I tried to do it, but it's my abilities, my, my, my abilities, my abilities. <laughs> <laughs> Look, it's a corn cob for the non-believers. Do you ever melt butter and put it over corn on the cob? Absolutely goaded. <laughs> Do you ever not? <laughs> 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 
I don't know why I thought that was so funny. <laughs> <laughs> this is a skip? This is not a skip. Skylar, do you know what would happen? <laughs> Skylar, do you have any idea what would happen if I suddenly stopped showing up to Riz Academy? <laughs> Or maybe. Do you see? Do you see? Do you know how many gats I raised in a single year? If I told you, you wouldn't believe it. A skibbity, so sigma. <laughs> a skibbity, so sigma. That it could, <laughs> that it could ratio KCO. <laughs> yeah, yeah, not ours. Yeah, 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 not ours. No, 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 not ours. Not ours. Not ours. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so I have to do the airhead, but before I enter the falling state. Skylar? Walt, please, just end your mewing streak for once and admit you're a mouth breather. Who are you talking to right now? Do you even know how much gaps I riz up a year? I mean, even if I told you, you wouldn't believe it. Do you know what would happen if I suddenly stopped going to Riz Academy? A skibbity. So Sigma that it could be ratioed by Queso goes belly up, disappears, <laughs> it gets fantastic by Quandale Dingle. No. It gets fantastic by Quandale Dingle. <laughs> <laughs> My goat is stuck! Oh, oh, oh! Skylar. Skylar! <laughs> I found it, Reddit. I found the exact moment Walt turned into Skibbity Toilet. <laughs> Come then. <laughs> oh, it's the owl. It's not a big dog. Okay, I can do that without the bird now. Very nice. Okay, enter the state before you start falling. Yep. Oh. <laughs> I wonder, I wonder. Is this a skip? So I should be somewhere else is what you're saying. Okay, okay. We'll come back. We'll come back. I need a bomb bird. I need a bomb bird. What is this?
let me analyze this. Level three door. Got him. If you could design any flavor of soda you wanted, what would it be? Look at the mouse. Oh, that's a bird. <laughs> Did you know that Coca-Cola has been making new flavors because they ran out of real flavors? So they've been like, hmm, League of Legends flavor. This is what it tastes like to have ultimate ready in League of Legends. Oh, now I can do this. Blood, shut up. No, you wouldn't. Corn, soda, that's real. That's real. Hmm, how can I don't understand? That doesn't make sense. How can I get up there? Oh! There's a switch that makes those things recede into the walls. It would taste like iron. What the heck? You can do that. Dragon fruit soda. Broccoli. You got some messed up soda ideas. Why don't you just say delicious fruit? I want to hit that button. Where is there a bomb bird? <laughs> Paradise punch laminate. Oh, I've just add this Paradise punch laminate Calypso. Paradise punch laminate. <laughs> and guess how it was. Hey, Igna. Hi, Jonast. It's Hucky Minjing. That's a lovely accent. Thank you very much. Oh, I've just add. Can you keep doing that? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I've just add this Calypso Paradise Punch Laminite. Suck your dad! <laughs> Do they really say that? In Scotland? That's messed up. I didn't make it up, it's from a video. Ah, oh, the spiders, I see. King Macrophage. Yeah, what I'm most interested in is that thing over there. <laughs> yeah. And this just activates, um... Wait, doesn't this activate the... Huh? What is that? That's a switch I've never seen. How do I get back on top of the church? Oh, look at this. A little treat for me. And I also don't know what this is. <laughs> oh, look, another bomb thing. I need to find a bomb bird here. And this just spins. It doesn't do anything. It just spins. <laughs> hmm. 
Now there's rocks in the way, you can't blow them up. Okay. Yeah, the music is goaded. It is goaded indeed. <laughs> oh, uh, there's something over there, right? <laughs> if you could have any thick accent, what would you choose? Boston, Southern, Maine, British, Irish, Scottish, Jamaican. Would I always have the accent or can I turn it on and off? This is an important question. So what do I get out of unscrewing that? What happens when you unscrew something? Reach a drill tower. Always. Hmm, that's tricky. Oh yeah, there's one under here too. So this makes the water go up. So this is just a little treat. It's really not the end of the world if you don't get this. It's just a little snack. Red screws are EXP. Oh, interesting. Okay. Got him. My Mountain Dew bottle. Yeah. You go for Boston. You go for Boston. I have to reach the drill tower. What's the drill tower? Yeah, you're a goat. And goats are kids. Look at the dynamic music. You have a southern accent. The only thing that sucks about it is sometimes you're treated like you're stupid because of the way you sound feels bad. Aww. I don't think southern accents are stupid. I think they sound awesome. If you're a boy, they sound really cool. And if you're a girl, they sound really cool. They just make you sound cool. Some are very d dignified. I think all of them are very dignified. You should be proud of the way you sound and the way, the place you come from. And like some people, some people are gonna be like, you don't sound like me. You suck, why don't you sound like me? But people who do that, they only do it because they're like insecure. They're, because they feel like I don't sound like that. I sound different, what if I'm doing it wrong? So they get really defensive about it. But it's okay to sound however you want to sound. Or however you do sound. That's how I feel. You can't do that playing around. Well, maybe you can actually, I'm not sure. So I'll try to make off with my stash while I'm more digger. Probably thought you were sneaking into my web. Huh? That game over is here? Yeah. 
You don't think surgery would change your accent training would? I feel like if you just lived in a place, like, it wouldn't require, like, effort or anything like that. You, like, that's just how you would sound after a bit. Like, when people move to a different location, they, they pick up, like, parts. They pick up parts of, um, like, the local accent. That's just how it works. If you live, if you live in a different country for, like, 15 years, you'll sound, like, a little bit different when you come back. That's just true. Mm -hmm. Hey, MDX Kai. <laughs> Do you think genetics help lubricate a person to an accent? I don't know, but that's a very funny phrase to me. <laughs> Maybe. Could be. I'm not an accent expert. Oh! Yeah, I don't know that much about accents. In fact, there's a lot more I don't know than what I know. I only know like a small smidgen. I'm not even sure about that. That's okay, though. It's enough to pass my tests. That's pretty good. It's enough for um, a guy in an interview to be like, You are a most impressive young lady. So that's pretty good. How can I do this? I wonder if another bouncy thing comes out of there. What's the drilling tower? Is that this? Oh, that's the drilling tower. I see it, I see it. I understand. And the way I got up, the way I got up was because of this rock. And I can't go in here because it's level three, but it's okay. The accent experts will tell you, yes, this one, because the tone goes up a little bit. Yeah, some people are like incredibly accomplished in their field. It's pretty good. It's amazing the amount of passion and dedication that people have. We live in a very interesting world, if you ask me. Hmm, this game is quite goaded. Good observation. That's the drilling tower. Look how high up we are. If he slides down, it doesn't look like there's anywhere else to go. Maybe those owl friends can help if you can reach them. Those owls can help you. Okay, these owls can help you. What is over here? Mm -hmm. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Is this a really interesting world? Yeah. <laughs> Are you interested by the world in which we live? Can you do that? Can you infinite jump? The corn store. to hit them. 
you just have to hit them. Mm, a bar. The bars could fly off at any minute, okay. Why is this helpful? Why is this helpful? That's congregated around steeples. So now I can get, now I can get, now I can get, now I can get, now I can, now I can get, now I can get. Oh! <laughs> oh, you're gonna be hearing this percussion into your dreams forever. Some people in England can tell the exact region you live and what street you grew up on because of your accent. I wonder if America has that too. But it's so spread out, so it's harder. Maybe. Oh, yeah, yeah. I feel like I'm doing this wrong. Why can't I reach the top? You can always do it like this. Zealand accent, New Zealand. <laughs> New Zealand. Oi. Oh, I'm from New Zealand. <laughs> Fush and chips. <laughs> Flesh and chips. Cute. I want my cute accents too. Do I have a cute accent? Do I say anything in a funny way? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay, good. Cool. Okay. How can I get to that bar? I don't understand. <laughs> cool. Flesh and chips. Fish and chips. <laughs> oh, ledge crawl, ledge crawl. <laughs> you set me up. You set me up. You what? <laughs> <laughs> I have no clue how to describe your accent or speech mannerisms. It seems completely unique. Some people think that I sound English. 
Some people think that I sound English, but I'm not. Okay, okay. Yeah, Shonda. I like Shonda. Have you been doing really good impression on them? No. Bish <laughs> Nidu. No. Can't call her Bish Nidu. Maybe um, one day in the future, people who use the internet a lot will have their own internet accents. And you'll be able to tell who um, is online a lot from their accents. What do you think about that? <laughs> That's already a thing. Some people don't understand what I'm talking about, but some people do. People who say Risen Skippy. No. No. People who talk in emojis. Oh, look at this. I did it. <laughs> Bats! Hi! Hi! <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> there are kids, you know, who sound like they're copying YouTuber accents. Whenever you. What if you had a child and whenever you talk to him, he said, Hey, what's going on, mom and dad? Like and subscribe! What if he said, make sure to leave a comment. <laughs> that exists now, Sag, Sagga, green text, necro, PK. Mozzarella meow, so you should just subscribe. Is this a new so retro indie scrambler game that's sweeping the nation? <laughs> Yeah, it's an indie retro game. To be honest with you, I don't even know what the purpose of seeing these bats is. I don't know what the bat purpose is. Because I thought they gave you the bombs, but now I think those are birds. Because those bats... Those do not give you a bomb. Referring to mom and dad as chat. Is this real chat? When I was little, I always pretended. Like, I always pretended like I was making a video too. It's just fun. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I didn't mean to press that. Yeah, I was little. Well, you don't think I was little, huh? You used to pretend to make unboxing videos. I did that same thing. That's so cute. Littler than this, yes. 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 No, I am very big. Why do I keep doing this? 
I'm scared of the bats, cause what? Cause what if? What if they attack me? I'm on the big screen. Are you lying or real? Is that real? I have a big TV. I got it for getting good grades. <laughs> Gum. Ooh, look at the bell. Ring the bell. Big grades. I did get big grades. I get very big grades in school. Why am I here? Why am I doing this? Do you want to talk? If I jump, I'm dead. <laughs> oh, he flies you, he flies you. Come back, come back. He flies you. Is that a house? It's a house. Can I access that yet? No. <laughs> yeah, the brain demons in Dark Souls, they love taking you places. Where are we going? This is a reference. This sound design is a reference to Banjo Kazooie. Do you know the part? When you're at the lighthouse in um, Treasure Trove Cove. Yeah. Ow! You killed me! This is fun, I like streaming. Are you enjoying my stream today? Be honest. I can tell when you're lying. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> I'm glad. Thank you very much. <laughs> Maybe a little. Okay, guys. Thank you. You're always so nice to me. <laughs> I will try to reciprocate how nice you are to me by being nice to you. How's that? I will try. Yeah, I'm not yet. Guess what? Guess what? I have exams this week, but I'm still gonna stream. I'm gonna do a survival game that I've never played before. I'm gonna play a survival game. And it's gonna be goaded, just like this game, which is goaded. This game is goat coded. <laughs> you look like a poor right? <laughs> I remember that. Good times. <laughs> Thank you very much. Streaming through exams seems incredibly tough. My midterms are destroying me, don't worry. Like. Sometimes when I, sometimes during exam weeks, I get so stressed out, I can't sleep. Like, sometimes, like, I get anxiety attacks at, like, nighttime. Like, um, whenever I'm really nervous about a test, whenever I'm really nervous about a test, I always have trouble sleeping. Or before interviews, and I always do well on the tests and on the interviews. But I just get so nervous before. 
the last time I had an interview, I was like, I'm too nervous to sleep. I'm going to watch The Beach That Makes You Old by M. Night Shyamalan. And I watched that movie and it scared me even more. And I couldn't get to sleep for two days. The Beach That Makes You Old. But that's okay, because no matter how bad things are usually, I mean, things work out. Like, whenever you're having, whenever you're having, like, worries or a bad day, like, it's never gonna be like that forever, because life is cyclical. And because it's cyclical, you can, there's different ways to take that. There, you could be like, oh, what's the point of being happy if I'm just gonna be sad again someday? Like, that's true. You are gonna be sad again someday, but you're also gonna be happy again someday. And all of the times that you're sad before then are going to amplify your happiness on the days when you are happy. You're gonna be like, I couldn't have had this happy day without getting through all of the challenges and stuff that I did. So that's kind of how I feel. I can drill now. The beach that makes you old. It's all about the beach that makes you old. <laughs> yeah, sometimes I give life advice. That's why my friend Kurok likes to watch my streams because sometimes I give life advice. What? How did you get into the spinning chamber? I love how his eyes change size. <laughs> yeah, he's fine. Tell you what, if you can find the disco balls, you can use the spinning chamber all you want. They got taken up by the cliffs, they're guarded by a dragon. Okay. <laughs> when Lily gets her degree, would that mean more or less time with us? Hmm, it depends on the week, but probably the same amount of time. I can't imagine there would be any substantial changes. I would say probably a Maybe a little more time. A little more. But I don't want to guarantee like, oh, I'm going to be streaming uh, six days a week now. Yeah. But I'm certainly not going to stop streaming. At least not anytime soon is what I mean. Everybody stops streaming eventually. That's why you gotta enjoy the streams you have. That's how I feel. Project Zomblade, that's my favorite. I love that game. Yeah, new quest time. When, while you're sad, it's hard to remember the times when you were happy, but that doesn't mean they didn't happen exactly. Look at that guy. Can you see that guy? <laughs> Thanks for here. Disco ball obtained. Good job getting the disco ball. You have to be level three to go through there. Hmm, I see. This game makes you value every single coin. Lily Hops would be Negan if we made a massive frog Zomblade server. Is Zomblade more survival than crafty? Project Zomblade is a little difficult to learn, but it's very rewarding if you like that kind of game. If you're a spreadsheet gamer, you will enjoy it. Yeah, it has a learning curve. I'm glad, just to reboot. Yeah, whenever I struggle with something like, like studying or a music composition, 
uh, like I just sometimes I just need to take a break from it. Sometimes I need to take a break from it and then I come back later. Well, when I'm taking a break from it, I call it quitting forever. But it's code. Yeah, my best friends know it's code. I say, I'm quitting this forever. And then I like do it again two days later. Yeah. Where am I going? I feel like a mole. Where am I going? Oh, I can control this. Hi. <laughs> Hi, combat kick roll. Welcome. Grab their web right after. After you hit them, you have to grab their web right after. Um. Um, these bugs are dangerous. I've been good. I'm studying for exams. Not right now, but I mean... I, this weekend, I have been. Uh-oh. Didn't mean to do that. Yeah, it's Mountain Dew. I'm talking about Mountain Dew, baby. <laughs> Thank you very much for the 11 months combat, Cake Roll. Stop. If only our exams were good apparatus. If only. I wanted to get a degree in good acrobatics, but everyone told me it wasn't a good field. Uh oh. Good night, Slim Jor. I hope you have a nice rest. I always do backflips. Hello, it's an original. You think so? <laughs> Corn Kids is hard, but I like it. Everyone told you you will not amount to anything. How dare they? <gasps> I go acrobat. Yeah, it does. It's very rewarding. Actually. What's that? Some kind of bottle cap from Fallout! Fallout bottle caps! One out of five bottle caps. Good job. You can also cross here if you would like to. Brave warrior. <laughs> Oh, smiling friends. I only watched season one. I like season one. <laughs> you wanted to study unhealthy soil for farmers with blighted crops, but everyone told me it was a bad feel. I love soil science. I love soil science. Don't get me started on porosity. Yeah, season two.
Analyzing. How am I supposed to analyze this? What? It's a different height. <laughs> Noella Channel! Thank you very much for the raid, Noella Channel. I hope you had a very good stream, and everyone please follow Noella Channel. Hi! Welcome! I'm just analyzing at the moment. <laughs> Welcome, Raiders! Hi! Oh, another path. There is another path. How can I do this, huh? <laughs> Got him. Ow. <laughs> yeah, corn kids, sixty four. <laughs> You better keep sick got him too. Hey. No. <laughs> yeah, I highly recommend Corn Kid 64. Kerbic music, welcome. I see a bug. Many people in Japan and Korea collect bugs as a hobby because some people live in high rise apartments. Many people, in fact, that do not allow you to have cats and dogs. So instead, they have little bugs in con containers. And that's what they have instead or fish or little lizards that smile at you. You love bugs. I love bugs too. You love smiling lizards. Hamsters, Google chat. I also love hamsters. Um, if I ever gotten a hamster, I spelled that wrong. If I ever had a hamster, I would name it Peanut and Button. I would have two of them, you see. Are bugs less disliked in Japan and Korea? No. Maybe. I don't know. I don't think so. I know bug collecting is very common, like for kids to do in Japan. I, I don't think, wait, okay. If you live in the West, if you were if you were raised in the Western world, did you collect bugs? Did you go outside and collect bugs and put them in little containers when you were little? Because I did, and my friends did, but I don't know how common that is. You did? Okay, maybe maybe it's common everywhere then. You had a butterfly box. Me too. Me too. You had to collect bugs for a school project. Lightning bugs and fireflies. Me too, me too. Okay, maybe... I don't know, maybe bugs... I don't know. This is a hard question. I can't get under there. Oh, but you can dig straight down, see? 
<laughs> Grasshoppers, frogs, ants. No one here did that. No. As an Australian, you did. <laughs> oh, toads. Sometimes in the summer when I go fishing and I'm in like a, a wetland, sometimes in like marshy areas, you can see a bunch of tiny baby frogs and toads, like just billions of them just hopping. Last year, you started catching Ant Queen and had them start colonies. That's so cool. I'm an opteran, buddies. Ants, bees, and wasps. I'm a beekeeper. You're an ant keeper. Cool. But uh, an ant, an ant enclosure is called a formicarium. Formicarium. <laughs> oh, um, I, I'm not a beekeeper for money, it's just a hobby. Much like streaming. You could say that instead of a job, I have like 50 million hobbies. That I'll pay a tiny, small, little, miniature amount. the bees doing these days? They carry so much pollen. They're doing well. Yeah, formic from a term for formic acid. That's because it was first isolated from ants. But formica is, um, it's Latin, I think, for ants. And that's where formic acid originally came from, and that's where the term comes from. But... Because they are so closely related, you can isolate formic acid from bees or wasps too. And not just from their venom. They do have it in their venom, but they have small amounts of it throughout their entire body. Yeah. What motivated you to keep bees as a hobby? Hmm. You'd have to ask me on a different day. I don't think it was entirely my decision, but I wasn't opposed to it, that's for sure. I do like bugs and bees. I think they're very pog. I think my mom kind of wanted me to. Um, but like, that's not the only reason to. That's not the only reason I did. What is that? Some kind of sausage over there? Maybe a jolly bean? <laughs> oh, I can dig up that pig now. Dig up that pig. <laughs> Did you get my Half-Life 2 reference? Dig up that pig. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they do. Maybe you can't dig out the pig. Unfortunate. Yeah. Um. Yeah, we have a garden too. And the bees go to the garden. Don't you use a fake fan? We already knew this. I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. We love Denji. Denji is a funny bunny. <laughs> I never completed Half-Life, Alex. I heard that game was really, really good. You ever play Half-Life, Alex? <laughs> yeah, I do blink funny. People always tell me about that. Oh, this is a bird. I never knew the bird was here. People always tell me that I blink so funny. Oh, 
hope it's cool. Hopefully cool. A shortcut like in Dark Souls. <laughs> Up that guy. Move that turtle. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Yeah, shortcut is from Dark Souls. We're gonna get to level three. How do you like that? Pick up that guy. Pick up that guy. Seriously. Pick up that guy. <laughs> Hey, go back on. No, I can't. I'm only level two. You played Alex with your Oculus? Have you ever played Bomberman? Did you know that in his original incarnation, Bomberman looked very silly? Ow. He had a little hat and looked like a salesman instead of a Bomberman. One of the best games ever made, Bomberman. I agree. You love the Bomberman 64 and Hero games? I played Bomberman 64 The Second Attack. I had that and now it's a rare game. I should still have it somewhere. Bomberman. Super rare game, yeah, yeah. It's like $80 or something, I think. <laughs> You have second attack Japan version? Yeah. Having Bomberman here and not Bomberman 64 is a very unfortunate situation. That's funny. <laughs> Pretending to be an old game? Yeah. Yeah, they tricked us. After Ben. They tricked us. I thought this game was old. <laughs> uh, but yeah, it's from last year. They definitely nailed it. It looks great, doesn't it? Corn. Corn. Hi, Lone Star Cold. Hi. Hmm. Where's all the corn? I don't know where all the corn is. <laughs> it's not a 64 game. Yeah, it's not. A one-horned goat. I love goats. I would be friends with goats. <laughs> ah, I bet I can do this. Oh, a circle. I got frightened. Hi, Chaotic Claw. Hi, Anathica. Hi. Goods are so funny to you. I would be a goat farmer. I would be a goat farmer, a dairy goat farmer. That's what I would be. Is that the bird? No, it's a bottle cap from Fallout. 
हाँ Yeah, I would make an obstacle course for my goats. Nothing but the best for my goats. The highest quality cheese comes from um plenty of mental stimulation. If you want good goat cheese, you gotta activate those almonds. Animals make tastier animal byproducts. Mmm. Mmm. I heard that's actually true. I don't. I don't know if it's like scientifically true, but I've heard that anecdotally. Dotally. That's so fun to say. Anecdotally. Feel like retro game devs skip the PS1? No way. There's a lot of um, well, this is the same console era, so any um any N64 game could be also on PS1 too. But there's the haunted PS1 demo disc. There's a lot of PS1 games that are present. I said that so smugly, like. <laughs> well, you see. How can I get up there? I have to find a way. It's not that. <laughs> Thank you, Canis. Itchio? Yeah, 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 exactly. A lot of good games on Itch.io. Hello. Hmm, I see. They transformed the mayor into a, a god dang salami! Oh, he wants bottle caps for a miracle tonic. That is just like Ikumbokum. <laughs> yeah, they turned the man into a salami. They turned him into a salami. <laughs> Go hang a salami. I'm a lasagna hog. Oh, I get it. I get it. Finally, I get it. Did you look into Pretendo game? Hey, Goji Kochi. Did you look into Pretendo games because of Gwimbly from Smiling Friends? I've seen Smiling Friends season one. Is is Gwimbly from that? I don't want to sound like a fake fan. I don't want to sound like a fake fan. <laughs> From season two. What happens if I do this? Oh, nothing. Stop! They showed season two, episode one on April Fools, and it had Glimbly. I don't know the Glimbly, I'm sorry. Oh, 
wish I had the Gwimbler. I want to get him. I love the music. I could listen to it all night. Do you ever fall asleep listening to a music on repeat? I do that sometimes, I do that sometimes. It really affects the type of dreams you have, really, too. I'm so sick of these sneaky turtles. You turn off your electronic devices before bed. It's not a plane. You don't have to do that. I'm just kidding, you can if you want to. <laughs> you fell asleep on all the balloons. <laughs> you snooze in an airplane craft. this section unlocked because well maybe that's not true I could try blowing this up but I don't think I can get here in time <laughs> okay, Nemo, Nemo, I hope you have a good rest. Let me analyze this really quickly. Uh oh. Oh, that's a bottle cap. I'm on a bottle cap quest. Mm -hmm. Oh, you can blow these up. You can blow those up with bombs. I think I've tested this before. didn't work. What a tricky game. This game is tricking me. <laughs> oh, I can't. I bet you. 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 <laughs> I have an idea. I have an idea. How much? Mmm. I bet you. I bet you a bunch of channel points. I bet you a bunch of channel points that this will work. You just beat this game? Heck yeah. Hope you enjoyed it. I win. I win. I win the channel points. <laughs> I won the bet. I won the bet. But what's tricky about this? Spot in the wall? I'm not sure. I don't know what you mean.
I bet Goki would think this song is a banger. Definitely. My prize, a fruits pig. I paid so much money for fruits pigs. I can't believe it. It would have been like two dollars. Move. The fruits pigs. I paid the import fee for the fruits pigs to gain access to the country. How can I? How can I? The thing you just unscrewed. It was this. It was just this thing. Can you head about the sticking out block? Um, well, I'm, no, I'm trying to get the, what the heck? You're a super genius. You're a super genius. How did you know that? How did you know that? You're a super genius. Please give me some dream soda. No, I believe you, I believe you. I was just being silly. I love the zoo. Me too. Last time I went to the zoo, it was just a couple of muskrats and a cow. <laughs> I first got games. I know you've been here. Hi. Maybe the suit will be better. How am I gonna get in there though? Oh, um, you can't dig under. Maybe, maybe you can dig under something else. Sanitary zoo. What mean you by this? Oh, my zoo. <laughs> oh, my zoo. What can be done? I knew the owls would ask me to close it, but I just needed to. Oh, my zoo. I have to clear up the oozy rat infestation. The oozy rats, huh? No! Woozy rats. They just woke up and they're feeling a little bit. Oh. Woozy. <laughs> okay, let me analyze. Power spinny chamber. Okay, and we do that by getting five disco balls. Three disco balls, I think. <laughs> I bet there's one in the oozy woozy chamber. That's a bottle cap. We only need three more. How can I get up there? This game could make you go crazy if you're not careful, but in a good way. Got them. Cubes. I've got my cubes. Huh? 
car. Mm -hmm. It says you have to dig somewhere else. Is that what it said? This game is Corn Kid 64. Got it. Turtle. You have to use the turtle? That's not what it said. Is it? To bounce is what you mean. To bounce up. You're so smart. You're such a genius. <laughs> Hi. I like the turtles' big eyebrows. They're very funny looking. I wish I was a genius. There's, some, there's different types of genius. You can be a genius of being kind to other people. Try it. It's goaded. It's goat coded. Okay, good night, magical arson. I hope you have a good rest. I keep aiming it downward and killing myself and punch myself in the head. I have to just not aim downward. Do I still have mid caps? I do. Thank you for the follow. What should I blow up after I have the bat, the birds? There's another bird down there, so it has to be something up here. Maybe it's this. Bat underscore level just subscribed. <gasps> really, really hard. Don't level! Thank you very much for the 16 months and the heart emojis. Thank you very much. That's one of my favorite streamers ever. Oh, you're woozy. I have to lure this turtle. A woozy babu. Correct. Correct. Okay, do not aim downwards. <laughs> Go to the retro gamer, sure. Sure. Oh, these are the woozy rats. I have never ever rat helmet her. Oh, my oxygen is low because of the woozy contamination. It's okay, I can just step out. Halfway of crates. Oh, that was a woozy rat. <laughs> they scream. Oh, half life crates because they float. Um, I hate to break it to you, Gordon. But all boxes float. Fresh air, fresh air. I hate to remind you of this. Gordon, Gordon, Gordon Ramsay. Okay, good night, folks. Speaking backs. Oh, I forgot to. 
I wish you could just take them outside. It's kind of messed up that you have to kill them. Sometimes I watch um, videos where people's houses are like overrun by bees and they have to call beekeepers and they're like, please, please save us from the bees. Have you ever seen one of those? Hmm. Let me analyze this. You had to do that once. Oh, really? This is like a little petting zoo thing. I should go to a petting zoo. <laughs> they give you a very respectable amount of oxygen. That's a funny pushing animation. <laughs> The bees need saving from use. No, that's not what happened. Okay, let's go where you're at. I'm gonna go get some oxygen. Hmm. Oh, a pipe. Do those connect? No, that's not what they say. That's not what they say. Not even close. Not even close, Skylar. Ah, I should have climbed this. Where is the woozy rat? Where is the woozy rat? I don't know what to get him. Skylar, do you know what would happen? Okay, just start from where the rat is and then follow backwards. So you climb that. You're on the platform. You have a jumpy. Where's the jumpy go to? I need oxygen. <laughs> you like the woozy rat? Oh, I see. Well, then why don't you marry it, huh? You have to marry it then. I'm analyzing this really quickly. They said no. Sag! <laughs> Could you imagine <laughs> punching a rat and it makes those sounds like a human? <gasps> Lisa Lovitz, thank you very much for the raid. I hope you had a great stream. Thank you very much. Thank you for your consideration and I hope you had a great stream. I gotta get some oxygen. You could never punch a rat. Why? Because they're too small? Why? <laughs> This is not work. Oh, they're too cute. They're very cute. That was a trick question I gave. And you succeeded. I was trying to see how many members of my community would punch a mouse if they had the opportunity. And you passed the test. I'm sorry for testing you. I just had to know you were ready.
It's because you're born with two birthrights, and that's too much power. Hmm. I'm low on oxygen. I'm just analyzing. You're 14 hours in? Good job. I hope you enjoyed your 14 hours. Okay, there's no way to cross. I know I can get to the top of there, but that appears to be blocked. Is that a ledge? Is it just really clever? I don't think it is a ledge. Mm -hmm. You like the goop? Would you live in here? Are you a woozy rat? Because this place is infested by woozy rats. And they love goop. You do? You're a woozy rat? Okay, you're a woozy rat. Goop is cool. I used to have thinking goop that I would squish with my hands while I was studying. And it had little bees and honeycomb hexagons in it. I miss those days, Sajja, Sajika. That was like nine months ago. And there's a woozy rat. Do I really damage boost the woozy rats? It seems unethical. Ah, look at this. This is rotating. Are you AI? Yes. <laughs> yes, I am AI. What is up? No, I'm not AI. No, I'm a person. I'm a human. I'm a you. I'm a human being. With a feelings. And a collection of fruits, pigs. As an AI language model, I don't like the way you're talking. Oh, that was that was uh, that was a decision. I'm a real human being. I'm not. I'm not. You would say this about me. <laughs> My corn kid died. Back to the zoo. Oh, now I have to get all six rats again. That's okay, I kind of liked it. <laughs> Corns again. Corners. Pop corners. They're pop corners, Jesse. We have to make snacks. Have you seen those commercials? The Breaking Bad commercials, but with popcorners. Jesse. They're made entirely from non-GMO ingredients, Jesse. This game has a lot of Conquer DNA. It does. But there's also a few Banjo-Kazooie references. And I haven't played Donkey Kong 64, but I bet, I bet you I have some of that. And probably a bunch of Mario stuff too. For all of the Marians who are watching. Ha <laughs> ha! 
<laughs> no, they're not called Italians. I was watching study materials online last night and I found this I found this instructor who has a super super heavy Italian accent. <laughs> That was a great video. I learned a lot. I love being exposed to new, like, not just accents, but like, ways of speaking. Accents, I think, are like, included in what I enjoy. But it doesn't even have to be an accent. It can just be like a certain... <laughs> no, the, the, the zoo has been overrun by goopy rats. It's okay, it's not normally like this. Maybe. I like it when people are funny. Like the number one best way. The number one best way to make me laugh if I'm feeling blue is Oh, is there a way to get up there? Is to do a silly voice or like say something in a really silly way. I love that. I need to cross over. But how? <laughs> Hello, Lady Hopkins. <laughs> Hello, Lily Hopkins. You can type things in a silly way. Sometimes. If you're silly enough. Can I crawl? No, that's that's blocked off. Hmm. Okay, is this blocked off too? Yes. It is. <laughs> I think I have to get into that cage. But how can I reach it? Oh, there's a pipe. I see pipes. This goes to the center, I see it. It might be easier to do this from the other side. <laughs> I'm damage boosting. We're doing it. Hi. Only one singular goopy rat is left. to do this without taking damage, I wonder. I would feel kind of bad if I didn't figure out the intended solution. Ah, goopy. No, that's not it. Maybe you can make the jump from the other side. Oh, a pipe, a pipe. I wonder where that goes. Where does that go? Is this the way you're supposed to get across? That was almost a cool trick. Yeah, I know a lot of cool tricks. Do a lot of cool tricks sometimes. Do a lot of couple cool tricks. Yeah. I don't 
think it links to that bottom room, but maybe it does. Maybe it doesn't, I'm just goofy. Let's test it. I need to see if I'm goofy. I'm trying to, like, especially cherish my time with this game because I don't think it's very long. I'm pretty sure this game is, like, one level. Or maybe two levels. Or no levels. Is that it? I thought I saw something on the floor. Hmm. I think when I'm in a good mood, I like to hum. It's my little humming trick. That's him, that's him. The disco ball. So this purifies the room, which makes it less woozy to walk around. Pachi, 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 pachi. Pachi, 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 pachi. Okay. This song is weird. This version of the song. This version of the song is very strange. <laughs> Maybe this version of the song thinks you are weird, huh? Yeah, I saw it, I saw it when the room was still goopy. I already saw that. Hi, Vitamin Deek. <laughs> Climbing up may be the best decision. Oh! <laughs> It sounds like when Banjo Kazooie are falling from too high. Goop Kids. No, it's Corn Kids. It's called Corn Kids. I think more games should have a mid air dash. It's like the Dark Souls role, but for platforming. It's the Celeste dash. That was very strange looking. Time to heal. Time to heal. What's your favorite kind of corn? I like dessert corn. <laughs> blue corn. You can have blue corn. Corn that is the color blue. I've never had that. Is it good? I care not beard. Hi, Oster Dane. Hi, Dolly Chronicle. 
Daily Chronicle? I'm not sure. Hi Kvik, yeah, I know that song. I kind of like that movie, I think. I think I remember liking it. Okay, we got it. Okay, it's just experience. This is not how you get over there. Look, it looks so cute. Let me out, let me out. I feel like whoever made this game really loved it. Corn jail. My, my oxygen is full. I guess the whole point of being in here was just to get that disco ball. We need two more bottle caps. I'm a one-horned goat with corn powers. They're like psychic powers, but they only affect corn. Just subscribed. Hi, Reg, 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 Reg That was a tough one. Thank you very much for the prime sub. Hi, Peg. Bazoo. <laughs> Yay. Bazoo has been very sanitized. If you happen to find any loose change under all that ooze, you can keep it. The metal worm. Oh, in the owl pellet pit. In the, uh, the golden worm in the owl pellet pit. Pe pe I know where that is. Couple more scraps and a cow. I hope you enjoyed the stream. Thank you very much for watching. <laughs> That's what you're supposed to say when somebody follows you. Okay. Who's the goat that comes out of the portal? Uh, that's my friend. We both like nachos. I need to eventually find a way to, uh, to move those blocks. It might be my sister, I'm not sure. It's possible. Got some cubes, let's go. Cube time, cube time. Nachos have been the foundation of many a friendship. That's cute. I like that. I'm trying to power the spinny chamber. Right, right. I like how much there is to do in this area. Even if it's the only area in the game, I like... Okay, so what I like about this area is it's not that big, but there's so many inter interwoven things to do. So you get really familiar with the area. Like in the beginning, you're like, I, I'm not sure what, like, what is over here, what's over here? But you become like intimately familiar with like all of the areas and the characters and like, oh, this guy wants this, this guy wants this. It's really cool. There's a bottle cap in there, by the way. If I had a bomb bird, I could open this. Yeah, the colors are crazy. I agree. There's a variety of corn called glass gem corn that's rainbow colors. It's real. It's real? You promise? Do you promise it's real? 
Not lying to me, not fibbing. Okay, can you don't? Can you don't? I see a cube. Ow! I see a cube. I got a cube. I have to find some uh, vending machines. What arcana do you want for your cards? Hmm. I have to think about it. I'm not sure. I have to think about it. I have to think about it. But you should message me. You should message me. Okay, I will. Oh, there's, there's another bottle cap. Those are the last two. They're in the graveyard. Name location. This guy ended up with the default tombstone. Sad. <laughs> That's so cute. <laughs> That's my favorite joke in this. <laughs> Discord or Twitter? Um, Discord. Sad. I know can climb. Okay, can climb. If I could find a bird around here, not an owl. If I could find a real bird around here, that would be good. Maybe there's one over there. Mm How am I supposed to do that? That seems like I can't do it. enough to correct them the whole point of the whole point of communication is to disseminate ideas and you clearly understood what was being said Sometimes me and Goki have some brutal typo matches back and forth, like entire paragraphs of non-stop typos. It's quite impressive in a sad way. Vitality. Who usually wins? We both win because we're having fun and we realize friendship is more important. Bombard, too far away to safely carry, which is annoying. Can I aim it like this? Not really, no. Maybe I need to go get that golden worm. I doubt I need to go back to the church, right? There's no way I need to go back into the church. I'll look anyway, I'll look anyway. No, I won't. Yeah, I will. I see a cube. Me a moody baby, do my yam. Mm -hmm. 
It's not indecisive, I just decided both options at the same time. No, we are decoding them. They're palindromes, you don't have to decode them. If you read them one direction, you already decoded them. No, they're not anagrams. Wow. <laughs> I love wow. It's so funny. Uh-oh. Yeah, I'm still taking recommendations for survival games. If you have a survival game that you like, please let me know. Because I want to stream a survival game during exam week. Because, really, what more of a survival game is there than exams? Close. Planet Crafter. What's Planet Crafter? That sounds sick. Minecraft. I could play a little Minecraft. -a. Do you like Minecraft? -a? Why are all the kids into Minecraft? -a? Brown bricks. This game is the death of creativity. Uh oh. You're playing Minecraft. I hope you enjoy your Minecraft. You start on a dead planet. It's called Planet Crafter. Save them everything at Christmas in July. Everything's on sale at HH Greg. Two ninety nine. During Christmas in July. Panasonic Blu-ray 99. Planet Crafter. Shut up. Shut if up. this shut up. is to be the end. Shut up, shut up, shut up. Then I will tell them. Shut up, shut up, shut up. Of the beginning. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Planet Crafter. It even has it even has a it even has a demo. Cool. Okay. Here I am. Probably play a little longer. It's it's pretty late, but I, I could probably play a little longer, right? I've been studying so much. It's probably okay. What do you think? Dwarf Fortress, exactly. I love Dwarf Fortress. I'm not sure why I said exactly. I just love that game. As a treat. I think people who can use Detune effectively are gods of composing. 
a little longer as a treat. Uh oh. The Long Dark. I have that, but I haven't played it. In fact, uh, I got a free key for that. Like a free promotional key for that. And I still never played it. I really should. It looks good. Hey, Jordan, the kitty. Are you a kitty? Oh, that, oh, that. Uh oh, that's too close. You really like the long drag because you spend the whole game surviving and looting and making every big zigzag and color come instead of getting from the basic resources within the first hour. Rap God. Skylar, do you know what would happen if I suddenly stopped showing up to Riz Academy? Skylar. A skibbity. So Sigma. Uh. A skibbity. So Sigma. It could break the Ocasio. <laughs> It could ratio KCO. <laughs> no, it's not funny. No. I'm being serious. <laughs> Skylar. Do you know what would happen? Uh oh! <laughs> yeah, I'm being serious. Lily, tell me quick. Quick, quick. So far, the two things that you find funny are breaking bad memes and punching wheezing rats. This streamer is messed up. No. Yeah, very serious, big sister laughter. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I'm very big. Excellent analysis. Hi. Oh! Oh no. Yeah, I keep slamming him into the walls. I think the character designs in this are very cute, don't you? Look, the boy goat and the girl goat. They're friends. The torn jeans look, yeah. I like it. They're, they're grunge goats. They're grunge goats. Maybe emo goats, perchance. I like the designs too. Vintage story, yes. Vintage story has been mentioned and I wrote it down. Oh, that was close. Okay, it's straight up. Yep, perfect. Okay, good try. It's straight up and then a little bit to the right. So if you're gonna lean to a side, pick the right. The Minecraft Eldritch game. Delightfully Eldritch. I want to experience what life is like with a mini fridge. Can you imagine? You have one and it's dope. 
Every time. Every time. Oh, you have one? You have one too? I don't have one. I don't know why I said two. <gasps> Rizul! Thank you very much for the raid. Let's go! It's Rizul! Everyone, please follow Rizul. Hello, Savinka. Hello, Binky. Welcome, Binky and Rizul and Taco Jacks. Let's go! Everyone, please follow all of my friends who ever lived. Hi! I hope you had a great stream. A little bit of a clap today. A little bit. Perchance. I hope it went really well. I'm playing the goat game. I love the goat game. Hi, Calvin. Hi, Linky Coach. Hello, Rizul Watchers. Tile heads, I call them. Oh, Binky played this. How would a mini fridge be different from a regular one? It would be in my room. <laughs> Hello. Rezdua. Welcome. Oh, okay. No, the angle. Thank you very much for the 48 months, Rizwa. How can I hit this? Okay. That was pretty. Oh, okay. Oh! Have you ever tried to do any voice acting with your skills? I don't think so. Unless you count, like. Mm. I have been in a few of my friends' like videos. If you count that, but I wasn't playing. I wasn't playing a character or anything like that. It's just being a little goofy. Good night, Oyster Dane. Round two, Ember. Friends with Binky, let's go. Is it a documentary? No. I would film a documentary. What if, what if I filmed a documentary? Oh, the detune happens when you warp. Very cool. What would it be about? It would be one of those documentaries that you can put on and it's like ASMR. Unintentional ASMR. The only difference is that I intended it for it to be. Yes. Maybe I would just find the most interesting thing I could find and film it. And make it like that. <laughs> About Denshi. For a documentary. Can I make a documentary about your understore? And how it was where VTubers came to be. <laughs> I'm not doing this very well. That's not where it happened. Where did it happen, Denshi? I love how warping replaces the f the drinks in the fridge. Anyway, every time I ask for a fridge, everyone is like, no! But I think it would be goaded, to be honest. You don't even just have to put drinks in it. You can put all, all manner of snacks. You could put it in a chocolate bar. Mm 
grapes in the fridge. You ever have cheese and grapes at the same time? One bite of cheese, one bite of grape, one bite of cheese, one bite of grape. It is unthinkably delicious. It's an idea that the legs of Ratatouille would come up with. Blue cheese and pear. Let's go. Manual charcuterie. Hey, shark is illegal to eat. You can't eat that shark. Charcuterie. No shark charcuterie boards. You like fruit? What fruit is your favorite fruit? Mm. No! on the soccer team and we always got to eat fruit during the breaks as a little snack. Perchance I could have my own streaming snacks in little bags. Cold candy. Cold candy is remarkably goaded. It makes me mmm. What's over here? Any secrets on the other side? Any secrets I should know about? Patcha, patcha, patcha. Ring the bell. These guys are like fast travel helpers. But I wanna see if anything else is up here. This is also a very good viewpoint. What's that tiny mini house? I don't understand that. When you ring this bell, everyone else who is playing the game can hear it. No, that's a reference to a game They're called Dark Souls. Dark Souls. Oh, that's blue. That means it has an in-game purpose and not just the experience. Not sure why I said experience, but there you go. The graveyard. It was a graveyard smash. I'm so excited for October. I know it's not for a bit, but I like to plan out my fun months in advance. And I plan on one CCing Deathless Cast Livanaya. I'm going to one CC a Cast Livanaya game. I see a cube. I see some cubes up there. It's basically here you can put out the pumpkins. I want I want to buy a pumpkin. I want to buy a pumpkin. Going down? They're so cute. Going down? Yeah. <laughs> Those cubes? I see cubes. Really? You put cubes there? Interesting. You want to carve a pumpkin this year? Good luck. I hope you can carve a pumpkin this year too. Did I see a gemstone? No, I didn't. Okay. My eyes are playing tricks on me. I have to be a level three to go there. It's locked from this side. Just like in Dark Souls. You know what game I love? Stanley Parable. You know, sometimes games are really popular and people say they're overrated, but I really, really liked playing them. I just say they're correctly rated. 
because I liked him. Did you play it on stream? I did, I did. <laughs> that one was a lost stream though. I remember it well. You're never able to play Undertale. Mm, you might enjoy it. <laughs> I hope we can find it again. There is a deluxe edition that I want to play. I want to play the deluxe edition of Stanley Parable. Oh yeah, the Owl Pellet Pit. The Owl Pellet Pit. Oh well, yeah. Have to be level three, huh? Did you look under the bed, Lily Hopkins? Yes. 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 I think this game has very good music. Hmm. We can get here now, I can tell. Small land, oh I have to play small land, that's a good point. Thank you. If I get too tired, I won't be able to stream anymore, you guys. I see a cube. That sounds like a dog, but it's an owl. Bowl. <laughs> Gamma Curse, let's go. Thank you very much for the raid, Gamma Curse. I hope you had a great stream. Thank you very much. Everyone, please follow Gamma Chris. And I hope you have the best day of all time. Hello, Gookie Dev. Gookie Dev, the very funny. Have I been down there? Oh yeah, I think I've been to the left and to the right, but I haven't been like straight across, which I don't know how to do that still. Wait, do you see that? Uh-oh. This game is very fun. I highly recommend it. I have a suspicion it's not very long, but it's also not very expensive. And it's very, very well made for the price. It's like ridiculously well made. You finished homework? Good job, Radio Jin. I hope you have fun. Okay. What is that up there? Oh, I've already done that. I've already done that. Because that goes to the zoo. I want to take Lily Hops to the zoo. Oh, I can use the bomb. Because uh, th this type of texture was the same thing that blocked entrance to the zoo. And I could use a bomb bird to clear it. So I can probably use the same bomb bird on these. <laughs> I wanna go fishing with Lily Hops. <laughs> I wonder if I still have that clip anywhere. 
the one where Krimba and Leaflet are just saying me like they're they're they both have Leaflet and Krimbo both had like auto tune, like a heavy auto tune on their voice, and they were just like, I wanna go fishing with Lily Hops. I wanna take Lily Hops to the zoo. It's one of my favorite clips, it's very silly. I wanna go to the zoo. You should go to the zoo then. It works, it works. Ooh, thanks. I was probably trapped in that owl pellet for a week. I did find this neat thingy though. Is it the golden worm? The metal worm? <gasps> Will this take me to level three? Probably not, but close. Yeah, very close. Thank you. Gonna need a mud bath to wash off all that owl stink. Okay, we could probably blow up this one too. Oh look, you can see the paint can. <laughs> Liv, we took you fishing at the zoo. You're not supposed to do that. <laughs> Are we going to the zoo? We're going to the zoo, yeah. I want to take dot level to the zoo. That one's not a joke, I really do. Dun, 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 dun. This one doesn't blow up, right? Okay, that one doesn't blow up, but I want to try this one across here. <laughs> cute. Yeah, that is cute. Zoo Tycoon stream. A collab with Dot Level and we play Zoo Tycoon, but then after the stream ends, we actually go to the real zoo. <laughs> and then we we upload zoo pictures to Twitter. I wonder what the fastest mode of travel is. Probably yumping, I would imagine. Did that work? No, it doesn't. Wait, did you see the feather? So oh, that was from the bomb bird, never mind. Okay. <laughs> Are we gonna see the monkeys? Yeah. We're gonna see the monkeys. <laughs> What's your favorite animal to see in the zoo? I like giraffes. I like giraffes, turtles, frogs, snakes, hyenas. I love hyenas. Komodo dragons. Lions and tigers, cute. Curious. You like to go to the bird zone? Are you bird coded? That's cool. I like that. I have a lot of respect for that. You like the big lizards and spiders? Big spiders, hold up. <laughs> Where do you live, Skyrim? <laughs> Cheetahs are neat to see. Yeah. Okay, there is a bomb bird here, but we never figured out how to get it. Bears are cute, yeah. What are the silt striders? Are those birds like cranes that live in like a delta that has a lot of silty stuff in it? You love aquariums? I love aquariums too. I want to see an octopus. Adult level, let's see an octopus. Oh, salt striders are from Elder Scrolls. Oh, I missed the funny joke. I missed the funny joke. I still think it's funny though. <laughs> Thank you very much for the follow. 
They're giant fleas for transport. Now nothing will be funny anymore, forever. Or was there actually something in the bottom of this? Cause I just remember seeing a skull and getting scared and leaving. Come then, I'm not afraid of you anymore. I do see a skull. Oh, look, look, look. Bombard, 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 Bundle Cup Bombard, Bundle Cup Bombard, Bundle Cup Bombard. My favorite Elder Scrolls game. I almost said my favorite Elden Ring game. I had to be careful. My favorite Elder Scrolls game is Daggerfall. The cheese grater. Yeah, and the spider coffin. <laughs> Spiders don't have bones, they have an exoskeleton, not an endoskeleton like us humans. Cheese grater! Thank you, I'm so grateful. <laughs> okay, what's her treasure? What kind of treasure you got? Nice. Aw, oh, that's cute. She helps you up. You need to play Daggerfall. Daggerfall has some really good mods. If I remember right, there's a lot of really cool procedural generation in Daggerfall. It kind of appeals to my um, dwarf fortress side. <gasps> Level three! Level three. They use hydraulics to move their legs. Yeah, and that's why they curl up when they die. Because the pressure has been broken. Because all of their cells are working to create like a pressure inside. That allows them to move. Now I can go into the level 3 door. Yeah, open circulatory systems, insects, and arachnids, and some other animals. Ye Arthropods use hemolymph instead of blood, and it's a combination of it's a combination of blood and lymph, lymphatic, lymphatic fluid of hell. Got him. I have this ongoing inside joke with my friends where whenever I see, whenever I see, hold on, I'll show you. I'm gonna make it an outside joke. Elder Scrolls Six. Whenever I see a tweet about Elder Scrolls 6 that uses this image, I send the tweet to him. And he gets so mad, he's like, you said this to me already. Yeah, this. <laughs> I'm gonna send it to him. Hold on. This image, this image. 
The Elder Scrolls Six, <laughs> cause it's used in so much stuff. Hold on a second. <laughs> okay, we're good. Did you sign the position? Usually those things, I'm not sure what that was, but it was the image that was important because that image is used so much. And usually it's something like, Elder Scrolls 6 is now in development and they've been saying it for like years. It's so funny to me. Oh, it's like a flooded house. There's a scary movie about a flooded house called The Deep House, I think. I think that's what it's called, at least. <laughs> it's the only image, yeah. It's like some mountains and the, the logo. Mm -hmm. They don't have any new images yet, soon. Soon. Mm -hmm. Oh, what's this? A button. I missed. 2017. We're happy to announce that The Elder Scrolls 6 is in development. <laughs> They've been too busy re-releasing Skyrim. I've been watching Skyrim playthroughs recently. That game is extremely good. Hello, Koba, Koba Ruby. Oh, look, blue. That means this is progression. Uh, let me down. Mm -hmm. I have to get the other side too. How am I gonna get the other side though? like this. I have good news. Nobody panic. The Elder Scrolls 6 is now in development. In case you were worried, it's real. It is now in development. Everybody? Remain calm. How am I gonna get over there? Oh, by walking. By walking is the answer. What the? You can't do that. It's a music box. It's a music box. Power spinny chamber. Um. What do you want me to do with this? I'm gonna talk to the guy in front of it and figure out what he wants. <laughs> it's a giant musical machine. It plays a song that owls hate. Oh, it was installed backwards. They bolted up the crank so it doesn't happen again. Okay, analyze, analyze. Owls hate the song. But the crank was installed backwards. Then somebody opened the top and it flooded. Okay, that's why it's full of water. So the owls... What? Is he all gone? Is he all gone? No, there he is. But it's installed backwards. 
Do I have to do something? Do I have to do something? According to this guy, we gotta make some music with this house, but you gotta do it backwards. A weird spinning machine that can help us. Okay, so use a spinning machine. Use a spinning machine to make it so the music is backwards. <laughs> ah, let's go to the, um... Let's go to the graveyard and get the last bottle cap. Owls hate this song. Click here. Sounds like a pl plane. Sounds like a plane. Erm, um, it's not a plane. Erm, um, how can I get over there? The critical finisons just subscribed. Lily Plaza. <laughs> Anyone know when Elder Scrolls 6 is coming out? I have good news. It is now in development. A lot of people weren't sure. It is actually now in development. The Elder Scrolls 6, we have an image to prove it. We have a new image. Never before seen. And uh, this proves that Elder Scrolls 6 is now in development. Oh, I wanna get up there, I wanna get up there. Hmm, if I had a way to jump higher, if I could get much higher. I see a cube on top of the spider's house. What is that? What kind of animal is that? It's not a springy pig. Uh, can I find a springy pig? Oh my gosh. That was incredible. <laughs> can I ask you a kind of philosophical question? Sure. You can just make the jump. You have to be very precise, though. You have to be very special. Uh, go ahead and ask me the philosophical question, but I'm not very good at them. Gobi. Gobi. Wow, you've got the caps. Wanna trade for a miracle tonic? Here we go, here's your miracle tonic. Oh, and I bet the caps were the caps that go on this miracle tonic bottle. Drink Mega Dream Soda? Uh, okay. Oh, it max increases your HP. That's, uh, okay, all right, okay. Hmm, I thought it was progression. Regimen? Creaky floorboards might have something underneath them. Interesting. Good information. What's more important to you, the memories of your past or the memories you'll make in the future? They're not memories if they're in the future because they don't remember them. I don't think. I feel, I feel like Retrograde amnesia would be more damaging than anterograde amnesia because if you cannot form new memories, you effectively cannot function in society. At least that's my understanding. I could be wrong. I could be wrong. Stoic meditation. 
meditation, no breathing. But you have to be able to learn things. Well, I guess it depends on what your life looks like. If you... If you are a person who constantly has to be learning things, that is probably different from somebody who doesn't have to. People have all kinds of different lives. So the answer probably depends on who you ask. And I guess you ask me. So my... I guess my future memories are more important, is what I would say. Uh, that's the old mayor. That's the old mayor. They turned him into a sausage, and they're dangling him. So I have to find three shiny things. Grounded is getting a huge update. I'll keep that in mind. Smugstar just subscribed. Smugstar. Thank you very much for the three months, Smugstar. I heard that limited run games is a scam and evil. But they are selling a physical copy of Grounded. You see two shiny things. Of course, Chisagi. underscore Tanchir. X100. Thanks for such a long stream. Of course. I was lurking all night. See you next time. Okay, see you next time. I hope you enjoyed my stream and thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate Chisagi. And thank you for the 100 bits, and I hope you have a good rest. Oh, look where I am. Can you collect this thing? Probably not, huh? I don't even think you're supposed to be able to get in there. Oh, here I am. Survival game? Yeah, Terraria counts, but I'm looking for one I haven't played before. That's a dot level crusher, for sure. Anytime I see a crusher in a video game, I think of that emote, dot level crusher. Okay. Level three, level three. Uh oh, did you climb all the way here expecting to get through this door? I hope your level is high enough, dot level. Oh, dot level. What happened, I was in the other room and I heard dot level. Because whenever I see a crusher in a game, like those ducks that you have to crawl past without getting crushed, whenever I see a crusher in a game, I think of dot level crusher. <laughs> Go outside and chop wood. Chop, chop, chop. Yeah, my experience is high enough. Don't worry. Don't worry, goat girl. Don't worry, very cute goat girl. Run, Bono! Let's go. Oh, this is a battle against the sock monsters. <clears throat> I have not played survival kids, no. You like the sock monsters? Do you recommend survival kids? No, I didn't hear about that lawsuit. It sounds scary though. I've been reading about lawsuits recently. Yeah, this game is ridiculously well done. What the heck are you? Who are you? Some kind of animal?
Maybe above then? I don't see anything to climb to. Hmm. Why would this be here then? What's over here? Ah. Oh, a mattress. That's what the point of the mattress. Default punch sound effects here, beloved. <laughs> rivet, rivet. Rivet, rivet, rivet. Stop making those sounds. You sound like when Gookie Dad is sleeping. to dig. Hmm. <laughs> I love the sound effects. It's so funny. Okay. Yeah, I dig it. Oh, treasure chest, a treasure chest. But how? I don't understand. seen the enemies. Hmm. Maybe those enemies have to be used to get to the top. <laughs> Can I make a attack here? <laughs> well, maybe you'll go the other way. Maybe you can stomp on this. What's the mattress for? It negates fall damage. That's the point of the mattress. Watch this. Never mind. I thought you could climb those. Because then I could do a sideways dig into this wall. They seem to be there to bug you. Ah, oh, so tricky. I can't make that jump, can I? Maybe I can knock these guys through the pillars or something. Why would they let you climb over here if there's nothing here? What is here? What is here? Is there something above? They were locked behind the blue screws. Oh, really? I don't think so.
Defeat them. Snoozing. I want to pay attention to what happens when I open this. Like, what happens besides the enemies coming out? Just a bunch of jerks. A bunch of jerks come out. And that's it. That's my favorite version of the song. I love that version of the song. The corn! You can't dig here, can you? Can you push this? You can push it. You can indeed push it. Hmm. So I bet you can push this thing once the guys are out. Is that the point of the matches? Maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe it's too heavy. Maybe it's too heavy. What else can I push? Maybe I pushed it backwards when I came into the room. Yeah, it does support N64 controller. It does indeed. And that's very cool. I didn't push it back. <laughs> Thank you very much for the follow. Can you only push this from the bottom? In other words, can I push it all the way to the side here? <laughs> oh, this is higher than I thought it was. Oop. What if I had butt emitter? Would this push it? Probably not, but... Do you want a hint? No! Yeah. Tell me the hint, Cookie Dev. Please, Cookie Dev, please! Tell me the hint. You can kill those bugs. You can kill those bugs! 
how you can kill those bugs by punching them into each other. Get those bugs. Do you stun them and then crush them? You can use them as a bouncy patch! You can use them as a bouncy patch! Thank you, Goku Dove. I like how they look woozy. That's funny. Hello, bug. <laughs> That's the solution. That's how you got three discoy balls. Let's go. But then, how do you get, how do you do the top part? Hello, Lord Floof. Oh, look, this is gone now. It's just completely gone. <laughs> you can push the pillar. 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 I have played Green Hell. That's one of my favorites, actually. Uh, this game is actually very, very small in size. It installed, like, instantly. Browse look files. It's 186 megabytes. <laughs> That's like 90 floppy disks. I meant compared to. I meant compared to. I meant compared to different games. <laughs> What's the biggest file game? Um, it's not a game, it's a simulation application, but I played Microsoft Flight Simulator. <laughs> my, my water is gone. I'm a little horse. Well, that just happened, yeah. <laughs> yeah, Microsoft Flight Simulator is like, how much is it? Like 100 gigabytes, 200 gigabytes? It's something crazy. <laughs> Baldur's Gates three is Baldur's Gate three big? Is 
I should get some more water, huh? Yes, maybe. Maybe I should. Yeah, I'm a pony. No, I'm not. I'm not. This was merely a trick. Maybe I can push this a little further away. Arc. Oh, that's bigger than I thought. That's bigger than I thought. I didn't realize it was that big. See, Microsoft Flight Sim is a game. It has rules, and you have to learn them. You have to get serious, because it's not a game. I, um, I did a sponsorship with Microsoft Flight Simulator, and like in the fine prints or something, it was like, this is not a game. Don't refer to it as a game, please. At least I think that's what it said. I might have dreamt that. Entirely possible. Please don't sue me. <laughs> Please don't call planes games. They're real. They're real planes. Patchy, 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 patchy. I love all the little jumping puzzles in this game. The sponsorship was a dream as well. <gasps> no! That's okay, as long as my sponsorship with Persona 5 Tactica was real. Because that was awesome. Persona 5 Tactica. It's the best. I listen to that soundtrack when I'm beekeeping sometimes. Okay, three of the disco balls got taken up to the cliffs. The zookeeper had one. One might be guarded by dragons. One was taken by a bird. Oh, okay, I know where that is. <laughs> the dragon and the bird are the last ones I need. Uh, I have to go to the big pit. The big pit. How are the bees buzzy? They're buzzy. There's things you can. F what the heck? Actually, it'll get you banned. Do you mean if you stream it or if you're just playing? trace back to where it is. That's the graveyard. Where's the owl? Where's the owl? I am so lost. Yeah, they eat corn. There's the owl. Okay, that means the bird nest is back here. No, it's true. They are corn real. I believe you, it sounds like it would be real. That's the bird's nest, that's the bird's nest. It's true, it's true. It wasn't me, it's Mario. It wasn't me, it was true, it was Mario. Okay, there is something that I need over there, on the other side of that. I'm not sure how to traverse that exactly. I 
I think you do both of these from the pit. Actually, the music thing might be from... No, what's the reverser machine? Hold on, let me analyze this. Do you know about the reverser thing? mentioned the reverse thing that is what I'm most curious about right now because I don't think I don't think I need five disco balls for that if the five if the five bottle caps were for a ma max HP increase And I'm sure after you get the reverse thing, you can spin this in the opposite direction too. And probably get a gem. To make the sims realistic, each player is actually controlling a- No. <laughs> no. Is there anything up here besides the zoo? Hmm. Can you play as a plas plasenger? Maybe, I don't know. I'm tired. I don't think I could beat the whole game today. Pig. The metal worm. The metal worm. Oh, I have the spatula, right? What do I use the spatula for? Or the greeter? Was it just experience? Is that it? Maybe somebody in the church knows. Hehehehe. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Free grilled cheese. talking about maybe you just power it on and go inside but I thought I needed the, the reverse sort of thing because people kept talking about it does they all like the music Backwards. It's <laughs> so funny. No, the music is backwards. I'm trying to reverse it so it's forwards. Cause he installed the crank backwards. We have to make music with this thing, but you have to do it backwards. If some guy had some kind of weird spinning machine that could help us. I don't know what the spinning machine is. Do you need all five of them? Do you need any of them? This is the spinny chamber. The spinny chamber is powered by these, right? Do I have to put it on these things, maybe? Guess I do need all of them. I should try to figure out how to get into the bird nest then. the bird nest through here maybe I 
bet I have to cross this, but how? Hello, Spicy. No, I haven't, Jordan Mallory. I've been um, studying for school. For school. jump up this far no way right but maybe if you if you use the spiders you can jump from there I kind of doubt it oh Chajin's column hello I hope you're having a good day Good, I'm very tired. I'm about to fall asleep. I will stream again a different day. Thank you very much for watching, everybody. I really appreciate all of your support. And you are very good watchers. And thank you very much for helping me. And I appreciate you. And this week, I will stream a survival game. That is what I will do. Thank you for all of the raids and resubs and everything. I appreciate you. Good night. <laughs>